So, oh, that's a little loud. All right. Anyway, we're going to be doing a game called uh, Curse Castillo, and this game is actually a was once freeware. Um, it's a Ghosts and Goblins kind of tribute game, um, except I think it's so great that it it becomes its own thing, even though it's seen as a tribute. Um, but it's a uh, I guess you could call it a Spanish version of Ghosts and Goblins uh, with a lot of European folklore and uh, a lot of a lot of just really cool stuff. Uh, but this game used to be called just, uh, and I'm gonna butcher this, but M Maltita Castilla. But now it's translated to Cursed Castilla. Castilla, Castilla, which is castle. Uh, my Spanish sucks. Uh, okay. <laughs> so, uh, we are going to be playing this game. It's an awesome game. And, uh, yes, uh, you know it. Uh, Somebody in chat says, Cursed Tortilla. I had tortilla for, for lunch today. Okay. It Castilla is castle in Spanish, is it not? Yes. I'm not just making an ass out of myself, right? <laughs> no, it's not. No? Yes? It's castle. Okay, so why are people saying no and yes? Okay. <laughs> okay, but anyway. Land of castles. All right. <clears throat> Anyway, so we're going to be checking this game out. Now, what's going to be interesting about this, I'm going to be attempting a... Uh, this is really difficult to do. Um, I'm going to be attempting a perfect run in this. And uh, I, don't know, I don't know why I have this on my desktop, but it'll have to do. Because uh, I don't have any other pictures on my desktop. But um, I'm going to be attempting a perfect run, and this is going to be hell. Uh, you have four continues in this game. If you use up all four continues in this really, really difficult game, uh, I have to reset the run. And on top of that, I also have to get these very specific items. Uh, I have to get secret items, and I have to do all of these things. And this is a very, very difficult game. There's also other stuff in this game that makes it even more difficult. For example, there's a part where you have to get uh, the specific item. If you don't get the specific item, and you die, uh, all the way back. So, uh, man, oh man, if I fail this, uh, there's a high risk I will. If I win at this, uh, I don't know. But I will say this, this game is extremely, extremely brutal. It's maybe one of the hardest games I've ever done for Harker Friday. Um, and I have been practicing a little bit of this game off stream because essentially... In order for you to even get to the final level of the game, you have these very, very hidden items that you need to acquire in order to even pass it. And uh, it's it's quite the challenge. And I hope that uh, I'll be able to uh, get far tonight, but it's it's very, very difficult. Uh, even harder than Where's Waldo? Maybe. Um, we'll see, we'll see. Uh, it might also be one of those things where I, I did a Ninja Gaiden Hogger Friday once, and I said, it's impossible, You, I'm not gonna do this, and I end up actually beating it in just like an hour. So, who knows? Uh, but, uh, at least the Ghost and Goblin stream I did, uh, I think it took like eight hours in total to do. It was insane. But, we're gonna give it a try tonight and see where it takes us. Uh, but what I like about this game, there's a lot of European folklore into this. Um, and the first time I played it, I couldn't pick up on all of it. But you'll see it. You'll see it. And I know we have a lot of Spanish-speaking uh, viewers, too. So you might be able to uh, decipher a little bit more than I could have. So, here we go. The Spanish for castle is Castillo. Uh, Castilla is a name of a place in Spain. Ah, oh, gotcha. Okay, so it's our, the, the region is cursed. Okay. Well, well, well. Also, I'll be playing this with my keyboard instead. I actually find that playing with a gamepad is actually sort of detrimental to uh, how good I am at playing it. Um, I usually don't get like this, but this time it, it, it just feels that way. So, uh, you know. But here it is. Uh, Alright, let's take up the volume on this. And this game looks very authentic. It looks like something out of an arcade game. All right. Uh, Endless battles left behind a sea of pain. It is said that Mora was crying her fallen love, when all demon heard her sorrow. Sorrow. 
seduced by the beast. You turn the tears into a magic key. And so with that key, demons were released in our kingdom of Castilla. I guess the intro explains it better than I could have, what the uh, <laughs> definition was. But anyway, here's the game, uh, Chris Castilla. And this is, again, a re-release of a freeware game. It's on Steam. It's also on Switch and I think a bunch of other consoles, too. So if you like what you see, I, I highly uh, encourage that you support the developer because uh, this is a kick-ass game and I really, really like it. The music is great and the graphics and gameplay is super, super good. Um, I much prefer uh, the gameplay, the smoothness of this, too, Ghost and Goblins. But anyway, I talked enough. Uh, here's how the game looks. Don Ramiro, Quesada, Don Diego, and Mendoza! Head for Zolomera and put an end to this nightmare. Yes, my king. Alright. I'm a little nervous, actually, because this, this is going to be one of those things where I have to play really, really, really good. I'll see if I can turn up the game just a little bit more, perhaps. Is that a good balance, perhaps? Yeah. All right, now, I might not be able to uh, read chat too much as I'm doing this, because this is going to require a ton, ton of concentration. Uh, but again, as you can see, this game looks great, and it, it looks very authentic. But the, the, I said the FM synth, the soundtrack, it, it, it just plays and sounds super good. But what's really cool about this game is that you don't need to wait to, uh, or rather, you can just wait for a new weapon. This thing changes out what you want. And the best weapon in the game for me is the sickle here. But you don't need to like wait for a certain item like, oh, when does this torch spawn and blah, 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 blah. No, you can just wait on this one. So it's a big gameplay improvement. Too. But uh, check this out. You can just do this. And then you get a little health and, well, there you go. <laughs> uh, but I also like this game a little bit better than Ghosts and Goblins because I feel it's 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 some more of a, uh, I feel mature is the uh, wrong word, but it's more bloody and gory. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm 10 years old, so I kind of like that stuff, but... Uh, you know. Also, uh, if I pause the game here, uh, I might get uh, banned. <laughs> I'm not gonna explain why. <coughs> okay. <laughs> There's something funny going on. I don't know. You tell me. Anyway, uh, here's the first boss. Actually, it was the first. It was the bosses who actually drew me into this game. Uh, there's a excellent YouTuber on, uh, well, on YouTube. I forgot his name, but he, he makes a lot of um, compilations of like you no know, damage runs on bosses in various games, and uh, that's how I got um, into this game. Uh, really, really cool. Yeah, YouTuber on YouTube, but uh, yeah, but excellent stuff. And I you saw the bosses because this this that's where the game really shines for me. There's so much creativity and stuff in it. And, uh, yeah, uh, I, I, I saw this game and I was like, I have to give this a try. Anyway, as you can see, there's a lot of uh, items I'm picking up and stuff like that. I'm trying to explain as much as possible, but um, yeah, I'm not, I might not be doing the best job. But check this out. Now, as I said before, you need special items to even be able to finish the game. If you don't get these items and get to the end of the game, the game just kind of says, yeah, sorry, you didn't get them, bye. And they run the credits. Uh, so, uh, ban. Why, why are we saying ban? But why are we saying ban? You paused. Oh no, no, guys, for fuck's sake! All right, anyway, <laughs> here's one of the hidden, hidden items. There you go. If you don't get this, can't finish the game. And there was no like clue to even get that, right? <laughs> Bullshit. All right. All right. Well, thank God I know where to get him. But uh, look at these bosses, or the bosses, this enemy. Look at this. This is the boss of this level, by the way. And these love like grotesque and like wicked-looking enemies. 
All right. Now, again, I'm, I'm not a speedrunner. I'm not very good at this game, but... Uh, so, I, I doubt that I will able, be even able to finish this. Uh, but we, we will see. We will see, and I, I hope for the best. Uh. Is this a new old-school style game, or just an old game? This is a... I think it was released initially... Um, I think maybe eight years ago, and it was re-released on Steam. Um, it used to be freeware, and that's the original Spanish version, but this is the uh, this is the Steam release. Uh. This guy looks like Squidward, doesn't he? Alright, so what you have to do in a game like this, you have to be very aware of what's around you as you're also dealing damage. Yeah. But, uh, here you go. For God and Castilla! There we go. Uh, no miss bonus. Uh. Alright, second level. Huh? Alright, so, uh... I really like this level too, because your, uh, your buddies here, Mendoza on the right, they actually help you with the uh, the enemies coming here. It's a, lot of, a lot of games just kind of treat your them as background things that don't really do anything, but they actually help you. Oh. Okay, I gotta be, I gotta stop talking here and actually focus on what I'm doing. Not that this level is hard, but, you know, if you get too confident, then it all goes to shit. Going good so far. Uh, Alright. Um, I like the, the owls just dropping soup on you. <laughs> Alright. Uh, so how I'm playing this game, I'm usually not looking where my character is. I'm just kind of looking where the the shit is dropping. Here's the, here's the boss, by the way. Uh, well, after this. Uh, Alright. Um, I'm not, the boss is not quite here yet. Uh. Alright. Uh, now. Uh oh. oh. Quesada! This boss is not too hard. There's a, there's a pattern to each boss in this game. Like any old retro game. Oh! How am I talking about? I gotta be really careful here. But you just gotta crash a lot and you know know what to do. Huh? All right. This is that soundtrack, too? Isn't it awesome? Huh? We'll meet in the forest, which is way later in the game, actually. All right. This not not might not be the first time or the last time you see me <laughs> go through this level because. Again, I don't have a lot of confidence I can actually finish this, because so far this is very, very easy compared to what's coming ahead later on. I'll take the, the double jump. Alright, and there's also a time limit in this game, which makes things a little bit more difficult. You can't run out of time and shit like that, and it's quite annoying. Alright, this is the first difficult part, and if I start dying here, then I can already tell this run is fucked. <laughs> so, I just hope I do well. Okay, I gotta use a lot of concentration here and make sure that I don't fuck this up. Okay, yeah. I think I'm gonna keep my... Uh, my double jump boots here. So far, so good. And you really gotta take care of all the problems coming your way, too. Like, as soon as I start neglecting what's behind me, and I I get a little too careless, it all goes to crap. <sighs> One death is fine. I already had a, uh, I already had a, <laughs> an extra life anyway, which I really desperately needed for that. Okay, one, one death, one, one dumb death is fine. It really is. Again, you can continue with, with, with uh, dying a bunch in this game, but the ending will be different, and I'm trying to get the, uh, the best one. So. Uh, So 
So what I'm gonna try to compensate is by I'm gonna farm a bunch of points later on. Uh, you can also get score multipliers, so it's gonna help you in, in certain areas. But all right, if I die too much in the, this early on in the game, I might just have to reset because otherwise I'll just be regretting like, oh man, I shouldn't have died early on in the game. And I'm not really warmed up either, so we'll we'll see. Okay. Uh, this is the easiest stuff, by the way. This th this game right now is is still like baby mode. Okay. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! I don't know if I can do this. <laughs> I'm really bad at this right now. Okay, it's all about it's all about concentration, man. I sound warmed up. That's all it is. I think there's a lot of pressure on me too, because I'm I'm streaming in front of like three thousand people. So, but I, I think I think I, I can do it. I can do it, man. It's it's all in the mind, as they say, or whatever, right? So, yeah, yeah, yeah. I am playing with a keyboard, yes, because I feel like this game in particular you just play. Oh damn it. Plays badly with the gamepad. I think it's just because my PlayStation 2 controller is kind of old now, and it's it kind of got a stiffness to it. And I need like every little thing in my disposal, control-wise, in order in order to be passing this game. All right, a lot of dumb, unnecessary deaths there, but whatever. All right, here's here's the CBT wizard, right? There. Okay. I do actually better with the uh, the bosses than I do with the actual levels in this game. I say that, but yeah, yeah. <laughs> Last life. Oh fuck no! Oh, I want to reset. Continue. Oh, this is. Oh no, I might have to reset. I might have to reset. I might have to reset here. Okay. This game is long too. Okay. So he throws out these little like, um, well you see it's it's the thunder that he's throwing out, and you have to be uh, in between it. Okay. Does anybody uh, know the story behind this guy? I know it's a lot of the different European kind of folklore stuff and that is the basis for the bosses, but... Um... Okay, yeah. There we go. Uh... Uh, he, it's an, a combination of Austrian, Canavera, and Gallic and Northern Castilian mythology. According to Austrian mythology, the Neveri also knows the Western Austrian story. It's the divinity of clouds and storms. So look at that. I didn't know that. Interesting. Um, that's why I like this game. It's a lot of uh, little this and that things. But that was some really dumb, unnecessary deaths. And I, I could have really done without that, you know. Um, We'll see. Bonus stage. Okay, if you have the double jump here, this is way easier to do. I'm also trying to kill as many as possible for an extra life. Which is not going so good, as you can see. There it is, there it is. Okay. Alright. Alcazar. Now they're gonna... Give me my first uh, real challenge here. Uh, that is not that bad, but it gets a little bit more difficult later on. And these these knights move in a very specific pattern. If you move ahead a little too close to the screen, they start to get reanimated. So I have to be careful how I like look around my environment here. The guys coming here. So they they start recycling. Um, I don't know what the trope is called, they're like demoting bosses down to uh, general enemies. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, yeah. 
And of course, you lose your weapon every time you die. Um, but the sword here is is can be upgraded in a later level. But again, if you do that, you have to uh, carry that sword with you for the rest of the game without dying once, and it's it's quite difficult. And I don't think I can do that. All right. Uh, so far, so good. I just love the enemy designs in this. It's it looks great. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Close. All right. There we go. You definitely want the sickle in this. I I would not recommend the daggers or. Um, well, I would recommend the. Uh, what the hell do you call it? Uh, the holy fire in this, which is basically the torch. It's 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 pretty good. But it has a bit of an arch to the fire. You'll see when I use it later on. Okay. I really feel like, oh man, I, I should have not... I should have not fucked that up with the uh, the continue. Like, it's really gonna bite me in the ass later on. And I, I, I really hope that it's just like me at the very end of the game. I'm like, oh, if I had just one more continue, I'm like, well... You know... Alright, well, again, it's all about taking your time here and make sure you don't do any dumb mistakes. Anyway, so, uh, this level has a, do uh, has a locked door. In order for you to actually get there, you need to get over here and get a key. And you can't die now. Alright, oh, by the way, check this out. <laughs> but uh, here's a secret, check this out. Right, and now we just leg it. Uh, Cause fuck that. <laughs> okay, uh, got a little more time here. Ah, uh, come on. Uh, now nah, we're talking. All right, so uh, we're going to going down here. Get rid of this wall things. Okay. All right, here's the place. Watch out for the dancing skeleton. And I got another tier here. Now, once you get these tiers, you can die. It's not like you lose them or nothing like that, but you, you gotta be careful. All right, happy skeleton. God. Yeah, and it's instant death, by the way. So, yes, so you know. <laughs> Okay, okay. <sighs> it's all about really knowing what the fuck to do in this game. And when you're playing it for the first time, you're gonna be like, what, is, what, what am I doing? So... Oh, come on! Okay, thanks. Uh, now I'm good. Uh, all right. Here's a weird boss, and I th I think I know the mythology behind this this dude a little bit, the Manticore. Uh, all right. Ooh, you know what? You know what? Ugh! Bruh. Close. There's a Manticore in... Uh, oh, I hate this room! There's a Manticore in Act Razor 2, which... This game reminds me of slightly. One of the coolest bosses is coming up in the game, by the way. Okay, yeah. Okay, we got the, the Overkill mascot right here. Okay, you ever played Contra 3 with the uh, the random fire things just bursting out and murdering you? Well, it's like that. Okay, I think I gotta get one of these things. Hang on. No, okay, there, there, there's, there, there's a book in the um, library burning here. 
And I have to get it to get the super good ending, and it's it's very, very uh, spicy. Right there, the best book ever. Okay, now, excuse me for like being silent during this part, but I need big concentration. <laughs> Tracy Kiore, the dude, the man, the legend. <laughs> okay, uh, this boss is not too difficult, especially now that I have this weapon. Uh, otherwise, it can be quite a bit of a pain. Those axes will fuck you up, by the way. You've got to re really be careful. Uh, okay. I actually didn't know the, the story behind um, this character um, prior to this game. So I'd actually read up on him a little bit, and it's it's like old folklore stuff. Uh, not folklore stuff, but it's a, it's a very old book that's written about... Uh, basically the author himself saying, Oh fuck! Thank- Oh, I should not let go! Okay, whatever. The author himself is like, don't read too many books or else you turn crazy. <laughs> It's not that old, isn't it? I know it's at least uh, 300 to 400 years, right? All right, anyway. Next stage here. You know what? I'm actually gonna go with the standard sword here because you can upgrade it here. All right. Now this looks a lot like that racer. Oh no! Oh, that was unnecessary. <laughs> Got to be careful. Mm -hmm. never, I never read that book, no. Okay. Yeah, come on. This game is about to go really difficult uh, close to this level. Um, I think it's the next part coming up. And it might it might be the deal breaker if I'm able to finish this or not. Um, it's just insanely difficult. Uh, right now I have the fire sword, by the way. Um, and again, if I fuck if I fuck up and die now, I, I've lost this weapon forever. So, but it's a really good weapon. Is this as hard as Shovel Knight? Uh, well, I never really completed Shovel Knight. Uh, I'd imagine this is a little bit more difficult because I don't think Shovel Knight's expecting you to do things on your first try and just kind of guess where the fuck uh, you're meant to go or go, I mean play. Like a lot of this game it just has secrets that are impossible to find without you knowing about them, you know? Okay, um, is it just me or is your mic sounding shitty? Uh, it is. All right, this this part sucks. See these turtles? <sighs> these turtles are slippery. If I jump on them just a little off, thump in the water, dead. Lost the fire sword, everything is fucked. So, uh, <sighs> and spikes, by the way, because you know.
boss at all. It's a little, it's a little crispy, a little crispy. <laughs> this game is, is, it has an expertise in deploying like tiny enemies that it knows this is gonna destroy you because you, you misclick a little bit. Or it's not that, it's more so that they, they come towards your way and you're like, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. <laughs> I also picked the, the wrong weapon there because I was talking, but whatever. Bolas. Oh. Well, it allows me to get the other weapon at least. So you got you got to see the positives, man. You know, it can't just be negative, right? <laughs> okay. Ooh. Well, that was a close one. See, I have to like predict where the uh, the fly will be. That's what this kind of game is. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Holy fire. And it is... I think it is a Monty Python reference, but the... Uh, the holy hand grenade. Okay. Ooh, okay. So the fire rate of this, this weapon is, is kind of low. Which means I have to plan all of my... Um throws kind of strategically or else I'll be murdered. <laughs> like like I'm not getting murdered already. Check this out by the way. Secret. Screw that guy. <sighs> not done yet. Not done yet. Okay, here's mermaids. <laughs> well, sirens, as they're called. I actually get an achievement if you... Uh, which actually is, is going to be required of me. If I kill one of these mermaids, uh, I'm not going to get the super good ending, which I'm trying to get right now. Uh, yeah, I need this, by the way. All right, I need to kill the boss here in one go. If I do not, uh, fucked up the run. Let me light your way, sir. Alright. Now, it's one of these bastard levels, huh? Yep. So, I need to get another thing in this game in order to get the super good ending. I need to find these hidden, like, little uh, gremlin people. <laughs> you'll see them, you'll see them. And I need a key, too. Um, this is one of those levels that has uh, a tear, which is... <gasps> Going to be required if I oh, oh runs over. Uh, can't get that crystal ball anymore. Well, at least I can get the good ending and not the super good ending. Have to restart the game at this point. <laughs> Should I reset? Reset. Reset. Okay. It is awkward Friday after all. I guess that, that, that could be a practice run, right? <laughs> all right. All right, we just gotta get out of here. Yes, yeah, a warm-up run. That, that's what it could be. Besides, I died so many times on the uh, on that one level, you know. And 
And we can, if we can avoid that, it, that's only a better thing anyway, so... Uh, you know. It's gonna take a long time to get back. No, it's like 20 minutes, I think. Yeah. Longest this game, I would say... Depending if you know what you're doing, like, complete run with all the secrets and to the, the final boss, uh, two hours, maybe? That's only because I, I die a bunch anyway, so... Okay, how? Okay, how? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm trying to get as many lives as possible, as I said, because um, you will really want them. You really want them. Play the new Battletoads game? I heard that game is kind of schnanky. I heard that they put a bunch of, like, hacking minigames in the middle of the combat or something like that. I've only heard things, but uh, it's meh. I'll play it. Uh, I want to play the uh, the arcade version of Battletoads. Uh. The really gory one. Oh no! I could have really. Oh. Whatever, man. Listen, I don't need extra lives. Uh, come on, man. Listen, I only need one life. I'm a gamer. Reset. Nah. -uh. Okay. Yeah. I saw somebody say that this looks a lot like Dark Souls, which is such a meta thing to say because, I, in a way, I always think that Dark Souls is kind of like a modern version of Ghosts and Goblins. Anyway, like huge bosses. You know, and the, the aesthetic is very retro anyway, which is like, you know, this is Ghosts and Goblins inspired, very much so. Which is some of the foundation for Dark Souls in those games, so I feel it's like a very meta thing to say. Okay. It was a very intense stream that, that I did of Ghosts and Goblins on the NES. Like, I, it was one of those things where I had to, like, just step away from the computer and do something else. Because I couldn't do the second run, I was just so exhausted. Alright. Uh. We're record for the for the good ending is 32 minutes and 16 seconds and only was one single speed on submission. Any percent has only has eight submissions. Oh I can I can join in then. Right? I can I can cement my legacy like I did with Pepsi Invaders, you know? They're like, hey that's me! That's me, man. Okay, yeah. You'll have to excuse the uh, extra dog shit commentary on the stream because, you know, I, I could be cracking a million jokes here, but I actually need to focus on what the hell I'm doing. Alright, uh. There we go. So far, so good. But again, this is still easy stuff. When it gets down to the uh, the windmill, that's that's where we'll see. Uh, that's where we'll see. Uh. All right. I wish the the extra health would actually help you if you had full health already, but it's not that kind of game. All right. Ooh, close one. That's why the sickle is great because it comes back. Uh-oh, not again. Quesada! Someone in the chat goes, Quesadilla! I actually had uh, tortillas today for, for lunch. But I bought the wrong kind of bread. I bought... Uh, um... Coconut infused tortilla bread, and I didn't like it. 
But I mean, I still ate it, but I was like, ah. Yeah, I don't know. It, was, it wasn't the greatest. It wasn't the greatest, but... I bought a really nice prime, like a prime rib sirloin that I, because I, I was really inspired after watching uh, a bunch of YouTube recipes how to like make good enchiladas, beef enchiladas, and it I was like, oh, I need good beef. And here's the thing, I felt the beef that I cooked with my with my enchilada was too fancy. Like this is a um, this is like a restaurant um, quality meat. And I felt I, I I squandered it on on a lunch, so I started like eating the tortilla with it. I'm like, yeah, this is great. But then I was just like started eating the beef itself, and I forgot that I even had tortillas. So, all right, this this weapon is basically like the sword, but does more damage. But uh, it doesn't really matter. As long as I get through this area, as long as I get through this area, that's all that matters. <sighs> I am a little worried. Okay, um, again, they just take one hit anyway, so... We do not we do not want to waste this. We do not want to waste the double jump. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. Blue Fairy is really good. Uh, it's just this fair that gives you one more, like, ball of damage. It doesn't do a lot of damage, but it helps. It helps. I can't. I cannot deal with that. I just cannot deal with that kind of bullshit. Just cannot deal with that. Nope. <sighs> it's a difficult game, man, and it's gonna get even more difficult as we do more of this later on. <laughs> it's a challenge, man. It, it definitely is a challenge. It, it's because I could I, I could just die and just keep on going, but what's what's the glory in having died a million times and just being like, eh, hey, it's fine, you know? I mean, usually it's like that on Hardcore Friday anyway, but 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 I feel this game demands it, so... Um, Alright, yeah, again, you really want the sickle here. Uh, can you try to hit the second world boss to save your night buddy? No, I, it, it's... it's He's destined to die, unfortunately, because... Um, spoilers! Uh, let's just say that something else happens to your teammates later on. Uh, I'm not gonna say what, but... There we go. Uh, that's fine, that's whatever. Uh, whew. Is he doing a full playthrough on this stream? Yes. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna try at least. Uh, and this, 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 this boss is so easy compared to the other stuff. All right. No, I'm gonna keep that. I'm gonna keep this. Uh, if I can avoid just an unnecessary hit here, that would be fantastic. Yeah. Well, okay. That's a weird system this game has for um, for ropes and holding onto things. It's like your glue on top of it. It's not like a. You hold up and you'll be on the the rope itself. If you just jump near it, you kind of just snap onto it. So there's been times in this game where I'm like, no, 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 not climb, not climb. Okay. At least we'll get an extra life here, which is going to be quintessential to this. And there we go. Um, like Tony Hawk rails. Well, yeah, if Tony Hawk rails was like. You snapped onto him without prompting it. Magnets. Okay. Now it's very important I don't flood this up. I don't want another death. 
I really could do with an, uh, without another death. Okay. Yes. Uh, excellent. Joel, do I like shrimp-based foods? Um, I'm I'm okay with seafood, but uh, I feel it's also because I have a uh, I have a inexperienced eating seafood. Like I like fish, but seafood, like I like shrimp on a pizza. Uh, I like deep fried shrimp, but I can't say I've I've ever eaten like a whole crab, <laughs> you know. So. You know, but this crayfish season in, in, in Sweden, where it's actually like, sort of like a semi-holiday here to um, eat a lot of crayfish or crawfish. I, I forget what it is, where you say craw or cray in America, but but I, I, I don't know, I don't know, man. I've said this before, but any animal or meat where I have to stare the animal in, in, the, in the ice as I'm eating it, it, it makes me not want to eat. And... I don't know, when it comes to crayfish or whatever, when you, like, you see the eyeballs and you have to like snap the head open, like, ugh! I don't know, man. Coward. Well, that, 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 that's why I like the uh, the uh, the Japanese aesthetic. Like, do you know why, why people in Japan still eat with chopsticks? It has to do with, with um, knives. And utensils like that is seen as a, as a form of butchery of the meat in Japan. But chopsticks is meant to like really sit and take your time with the food and, and enjoy it. it uh, enjoying it. Like, eating food is an art, man. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I don't know what, what, cause, it, but it's funny too, cause like when 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 you make food for yourself, you never garnish it. You always garnish a dish when you're making it for somebody else. But when it's just you eating, you're like, yeah, fuck it, just putting a, in a big bowl. I'll eat it with some ketchup. I don't care. Some scary. Oh god. Guess I that for the third time. Okay, yeah. Uh, scary. You know, lobster used to be really, like, a not, an, not an expensive food until the people decided it wasn't anymore. <laughs> like, <laughs> it, it's not always been this, like, very exquisite meat. It's just been like, yeah, here's, a, here's a spider that lives in the, in the water. Let's boil it for fun. And, and somebody said, yeah, this is very expensive. This sea roach right here, Mataya, whoo! It's good! How bikers eat their skeddy. <laughs> oh man. I do wanna. I do wanna. Try a real surf and turf. Like the idea of eating a lobster. On top of a steak is such a disgusting thing. I want to try it. I've tried surf and turf with shrimp, but I want to try like just put a graveyard in my mouth, bro. <laughs> okay, uh, one HP. Uh, why not? Uh, <sighs> surf and turf burritos. <laughs> okay. Uh, I guarantee you it's gonna be some cheap shit here. <laughs> like, the death is gonna be based not so much on an enemy, but like... Something. I, I just feel like something is about to happen. It's gonna be like, what the hell? Okay. We're gonna de demon here. Another demon. Okay, go man, go. <sighs> Ooh, 
Yeah, I'm a little too greedy with the jumps, I agree. Third one. Sorry for the thud of the uh, the keyboard here. Um, whew, that one, that one, good. That one, good this time. Huh? Excuse me. <coughs> Hang on. I'm fine. Random coughing fit time. I, I hate that shit. Okay. Random coughing fit time. I, I hate that shit. Okay. Alright. I'm gonna get a lot of extra lives here because, again, I can just do this. I think I can get it even more if I'm even better with it. Oh, well. Oh. I think I get one more, but it's fine. Um, <sighs> right. See, it, it wasn't so, uh, too far off when I uh, when I did this. Uh. Love the music in this game. Like I'm, it, it really depends what kind of game it is for the Genesis sound font, the FM synth. But this game does it really good. It has like a morbid touch to it, like the FM synth. It just, and it works really well with this game. Just. Like Road Rash and stuff like that, those kind of games. The soundtrack sounds awesome. Man. But then you have like RPG games, which this kind of is, but n no, it isn't. But you know what I mean? Fantasy games. When it's meant to be like a serene, nice soundtrack of just like, ooh, town music, it doesn't sound that great. And that's why the SNES sounds way better. Oh, well, actually, I can just do this. Hey, look at that. Why the hell do I... I'm not even gonna bother with the fucking weapon. I already have the best weapon in the game, almost. <laughs> I just went for that anyway, for... I don't know why. Okay, have I played Blasphemous? No, but I... I I've seen the little videos of Blasphemous, and it's... It's that game that has a really nice uh, pixel art style, right? Yeah, 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 for sure. See, I don't know if I should keep this. No, I'm not gonna do that. Too. Don't need it for this part anyway. Am I gonna play Val Ferris uh, soon? I just finished Carrion, which was a demo I played, and I played the Val Ferris demo as well. So soon, trademark. Oh, damn it! Eh, yeah, whatever. I forgot about the bed. Alright, well, uh, now it's just all about not fucking up. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Restart! Here's what I want to do. I think I'm going to go down here. Uh, there, well, there's already meat down here I can get to. I think, yeah. Right? No, that's time. Okay, well, there might be something on the... On the right. Hang on. Is there? 
Ooh, I don't know if that's gonna be worth it. Oh! <laughs> well, it clearly is not worth it now. Shit, man. Oh, I don't want these. I don't want these. Ah, oh, well, I'll have to do, I guess. So. At least it's not the daggers. The daggers are awful, huh? Oh, Alright. You should do a Dark Souls Hawker Friday? Maybe. Maybe someday. Be a very long one, too, huh? Um. Dark Souls really is not... Like... It, it's, it's a hard game. But... There's far more hard, harder retro games than Dark Souls. Uh, Alright. Oh, shit, th this part sucks with this weapon, because I, I can only have two at the uh, same time here, so I'm gonna have to be very careful how I do this. Uh, went fine. Okay. <laughs> Barbie games are harder, no joke. <laughs> well, that NES game sucks. Okay, yeah. I've always felt that Dark Souls 3 is what Dark Souls 2 should have been when it came out. Does anybody here prefer Dark Souls 2 to, th 2 to 3? Generally curious, if you have that opinion, then that's... It's all right. Yes, me, 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 yes. There's plenty of people, there's plenty of people, but I personally feel that 2 had a had a bad impact as a sequel, because like, the sequel to Dark Souls, where 3 should have been what 2 was, you know? It's like, I don't know what happened in that game, like, they just gave it away to, like, another team? If I were to describe Dark Souls 2, this is gonna be a very weird word, but I think it's... It's like they didn't leave that game long enough in the oven. Like, it, it was still a little too pink in, on the inside, you know? Like, just a little, little bit more. Put me back, I'm not done! Undercooked! Yeah. Oh shit, I hate this weapon! hate this weapon. Fuck that weapon. Like, I'd rather actually use this. Oh, no. Bola's gone. Good. Don't like it. and swine build. <sighs> Whatever. Let's get me through. Brrr, uh, God, that was dumb. Well, at least I haven't died yet, so... Well, when I say die, I mean... You know... Um, really could have done with the... Uh, you know... You know... I'd love to get that, but I would have gotten very hurt by these... Radius rings! Oh, man. Oh. Whatever, man. I just jumped into that for no reason. Okay. A coin. Nuclear fruit loops. Ooh. 
Alright, gotta get this, gotta get this in. Careful, careful, careful. Uh, careful. Uh, And I want to accidentally get hit by a bunch of crap here, too. Uh, there's going to be a fire ring here, too. Oh, here, I mean. Okay. Another one here. Uh, okay. Here he is again. Let's have the blue fairy, so. Oh shit, wrong place for the swords. Oh, oh jeez. Oh no. Can I have to, oh, turn around. Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. This is a good, good spot. Good spot. Yeah. Okay. Uh, he's being kind of nice to me by allowing me to hit him so much. Oh, that was actually okay. Get ready for the uh, the, the ceiling fire too. I got hit last time by that. Okay, here's the swamp again. Um, you can, you guys can really hear the the keyboard thud, huh? Yes. Oh, I'm sorry for that. It's like silent keyboard, but it's still like thuddy because I'm I'm pressing it so much. <laughs> it adds to the charm. All right, if you say so. All right. All right, fire sword. Better not die now, man. Now they want you to actually fitness the game now without dying ever. <laughs> There's an achievement for that. It's called Swordmaster. And uh, I'm not gonna get that tonight. <laughs> that's a good use for that emote, by the way. The, the flaming super death sword. Because that's what it is. That's fine, that's fine. Just get me through. <sighs> oh, boy. Sorry if I go quiet for this, but... that sword in. <laughs> but just wait this one out. Ooh. So much easier when it's not so much pressure, you know? Oh, Alright, so what do I want? I think I would like... Uh, not bolas. Bolas can go fuck itself. Uh, there we go. Holy fire. Uh, <gasps> no! Alright, I'll take one less HP, I guess. Uh, there is an extra life coming up, though, so... Everything is so carefully planned in this game to piss you off and make it difficult. Uh, I, I admire that, that kind of, like... Surgical precision to uh, make you uh, as vulnerable as possible by dropping t tiny little enemies just to make it worse. Uh. All right, extra life. Uh. 
Okay, the fire rate is kind of bad on this one, so... No, 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 no. Okay. How does he get owned, Joel? <laughs> oh! That's fine, I can take him the next time, maybe. Whew. Now, I'm gonna have to do this <laughs> with one <what> HP. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <sighs> no. Alright, I don't know if there's any secret meats or anything I can get here. I just pray there's something in here, maybe. Okay, and I have a slow fire rate weapon too. This requires me to be very, very careful. I'm doing this. Okay. Is there meat in here? Oh, yes. Okay. Oh, fuck. If I fuck this up, th these things are gonna start collapsing. If I oh, runs over, I can't get up there again anymore. I cannot. I cannot get. Uh, I need to reset the game at this point. <sighs> Shit. Uh. Yep. Why though? Oh, oh. Uh, basically. Um, well, it's, it's hard to describe what, what, what goes wrong here. Um, if you fuck that part up, um, you can still get a good ending, uh, but you cannot get the greatest ending. The greatest ending in this game requires you to... See the crystal ball I have right now? If I die now, um, that's from the last level. If I die now, I lose that, and I need that item in this level to get a secret, and you need like 10 secrets in this game to unlock a special ending. And if I'm dead, or if I fuck this up now, which I already have, I can't get that secret, which means no ending. So, um, yeah. Um, uh, yeah. Um, go for the good ending, then the best one. Uh, what do you guys say? Should I, should I just go for the, uh, like, A tier ending, not S tier? Yeah, okay, fine. Okay, well, so be it then. Uh, then I need to actually die here because that place right there requires me to uh, um, pass through first. Uh. Okay. Uh. So now there's less pressure, and I have a better weapon for this, but, uh, you know, I, but at what cost? Uh, It's still a very difficult game, and it doesn't mess around. Uh, okay, that's the part. Alright, now welcome to this. <laughs> now, if this looks like bullshit, I have to do this twice. One of the tears. There we go. Now I have to run back and not get hit. <sighs> All right. 
I, I knew they were gonna try to get me in the dark too, so... Uh... Okay, careful, careful, careful. We don't want to fuck this up. Uh... <sighs> Almost done with the level, by the way. Okay. Hey, guess what? Check this out. Uh oh. Anxiety. Oh shit. Oh god. Whew. All right. Now this I know if if you live in Spain, this is some sort of like um what is it again? I, it remind me again. Uh, um Does anybody know? Uh, man, I can't even see what it is. Well, you tell me what it is then. I know it's there's some something to it. Anyway, I learned that this boss, as long as you just stand still and don't move, it's easier, but this next part sucks. Because you have to just have a ton of patience, and I don't have that. Also, th these wavy patterns... I'm very bad at them. <laughs> okay, yeah. Uh... Oh, man. Ooh, close. Don't get greedy. Don't get greedy. Yeah, Leon's seen the statue in real life, actually. Uh, the real one. What is it called? Okay. La Dama de Elche. Okay. Okay, bonus stage. Extra life, please. I see I haven't used um, as a, a, a continue yet, which is great for this run. Because again, you get three or four, and if you fuck that up, then you get a bad shitty ending. Okay. It's the kind of ending that just says like, yeah, you did it, but uh, we're just gonna roll credits. <laughs> Okay, now they're gonna turn up the shit factor slightly, and uh, it's gonna get a little spicy. I was playing D Double Dragon 2 the other day, and Double Dragon 2 does something like that for the ending. It's like, oh, you saved the day, but uh, yeah, try playing on a harder difficulty so you'll actually get an ending. <laughs> it's like, come on. What's with that? Okay, yeah. Uh, I really don't want to start, start having, like, horrible death streaks here. <laughs> I feel it's gonna happen. I feel it's gonna happen. They got these stone dudes. You're gonna get some spelunky flashbacks as I as I play this level. By the way, it's uh, it's a little stinky. But I've had practice, so I'm Eggman looking ass. Okay. 
so this level is is a bit of a fuck. Let's say you hypothetically want to play this game without getting all the keys and whatever. It's like I just want an average ending, and I don't want to collect a bunch of keys. Well, this level at the very end has a, uh, a fucking hell. Look at this. Get me through. Sorry, I lost my patience there because I'm just like get the fuck over there. Um. This level at the end, very end has a a door that is locked. You need a key for it. And it looks like that key is optional, but it isn't. So <laughs> Luckily I got that extra life from the bonus, so that's that's good. That's good. Come on, come on, come on. There's a really clutchy moment at the the end of this level. You'll see it. Oh, so I can't just walk over this. I, I need to jump. Ugh. Okay. Go, man, go. <sighs> All right. Uh. This is going to be awful. <sighs> Got to time it right though. Okay, okay, it's all good now. Huh? Ooh, that could have been really bad. Alright, get ready for a shit moment. <laughs> Spider. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, where's he gonna drop her? the side okay definitely not the hardest boss but don't underestimate because if you do whew. oh I missed this hitbox okay where's it going okay. whoo that went pretty good Pretty good. <sighs> Splatterhouse music. Yeah. These enemies are very, very annoying. They are very, very annoying. Okay. I'll need all the help I can get to. Yeah, that shit from from that other stage is back. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta deal with skull spiders as well. <laughs> that was pretty good looking though. Ooh. <laughs> God damn! So much shit on my plate. I will take that. Thank you. Okay, no accidental like oops. Oopsies. No oopsies allowed. Okay. It all comes down to this. Don't fuck up. Oh god. Oh no! No! <sighs> Oh, man. 
Still going good though. Oh, that was too close. That was too close. Hitbox. Okay. Ooh, that could have done me in good. Okay. Can I reach? Yes. Okay, I want this. Just go, man. What are you waiting for? Oh, you know, I can take that hit. It doesn't matter. Okay, don't die now. Don't die now. I only have one life. I don't know. You might continue. It's stressful music, too. Get ready for a shit boss, by the way. Uh oh. <sighs> See, I need this boss killed before I reach the end of the stage. Ah, oh, first continue. Fuck! <sighs> Alright, I need every single hit here. I might stand very close to the caterpillar, but... That's only because they, there's no there's no room for faults here. Life left anyway, so uh. I might be doomed. I don't think I can reach this. Okay. There's gonna be a dancing dude here. No, no, no. I have a good chance of actually winning this time. God damn! Okay. See, I remember some of these... Some of these chests contain not-so-nice things, so I'm gonna avoid... The majority of it, except this one. Okay. Uh oh. Um. So you came here fighting for God and Castilla. Actually, I should do this this way instead. I was once the king of Castilla. But look at me now! Look how God paid his servant! <sighs> Proceed with your quest! Bring peace back for those who should be dead! For those, for the ones who walk before me! I just looked up a I just looked up a run and found a crystal ball in one of the cave walls. Yeah, that's the original game. This game is a little different. They changed a little bit of this and that. And in the original, you can find the crystal ball in the wall, not in this game. It's like you have one chance. For, don't fuck it up. 
Oh, come on, man. All right, I should be able to get um, an extra life here, maybe. Uh, Okay, these enemies are a little stinky, because, uh, yeah, it's this. What is it, Buster Bros, or whatever it's called? That gameplay? We have to, like, take the pieces and, like, eliminate them one by one. Okay, oh boy. Ah, yes, the sword! Ah, yes, thank you. Whatever. Be careful here, we don't spam the uh anything else? No, okay. Doesn't really matter anyway, because the uh, the boss of this level is is really peculiar. But there is something up ahead that is I would just say it's almost bad gameplay. <laughs> um I have to do something in one chance, or else I literally can't even get a good ending. Like I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get the, I guess you win ending. Okay, th 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 this is fine, this is fine. Another continue, but so be it. Oh, that, oh, I already took my life. Okay. But uh, yeah, basically, I can tell you what happens if you use too many continues. Um, it means that you die at the end of the game. <laughs> Isn't that nice? But get this, if you don't get those tears that I'm collecting, um, you can't get to the final area, and your character just kind of gives up and says, Hmm, there must be some way of getting to the last level, and then the credits roll. Now, isn't that fun? Fuck that. Oh. Okay. It's coming up. Fuck this up. And it's all over. Fucking pray that I do this. Otherwise, I have to literally reset. Like, I, I can't even, like, pretend. Okay, I have to get the holy fire. It's the only way of doing this. We don't want to hurt the mermaids. There's an achievement for not doing that. All is lost. All is lost. That's not the part I'm talking about, but I'm just, I'm just saying in general that all hope is lost. Okay. I'll, I'll tell you exactly when. Uh, stop it, birds! I just need the holy fire for this next part because uh, basically the next tier is is behind. Um, a wall and the fucking key what am I doing Jesus that's the whole point of this sorry guys <laughs> it's behind a wall and if you fuck up at that th th that point <gasps> no what you fuck what <laughs> slip off oh man that fucking sucks. Oh, Lord, no, man. Oh.
Last continue. Last continue. And then I can't finish the game. I start to play like shit because I'm getting very like frustrated. Yeah. Okay, yeah. I predict that re reset here pretty soon because I'm 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 dying too much. Yeah. Okay. Whew. You know what? You know what? You know, fuck the mermaids. I I'm going to kill them. Because <laughs> they're in the fucking way. Alright. Here it is. If you fuck up this part, you cannot finish the game. If you die here, you cannot finish the game. That's how bad this is. Uh. The checkpoint is here, right? And you will have lost the key if you die. Yeah. And again, it's it's that concept I described where it just starts to split up. But I used the wrong weapon for this, but I can also not die here. So uh, I mean, I can't die, but I am so limited on on continues and stuff that uh, you know. But really, you need to take your time with this. If you spam too many, if you try to destroy as many as possible, the the, the problem escalates. Oh, whatever. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Ooh. See what I mean? I start panic. I start panicking. I didn't follow my own damn advice. Fuck it. No, 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 no. Oh, oh, well, the run is literally dead. <laughs> I have one life left. I can't finish the game like this. Nope, I'm gonna have to do a new run. No, I'm starting to play like it because I'm getting frustrated and I'm playing like crap. Okay. Ooh, well, that's it. That's it. Reset the game. Uh. Yep. Oh, man. All right. Well, we got pretty far, though. We got pretty far. Oof. I need a little bit of break, I think. That's pretty much 40% of the game, by the way, if you're curious, uh, where I am. Blech. Blech. What a mess. Uh. All right. Well, anyway, uh, I'll be right back. Sit tight. We're going to do a little BRB. I'll come back to Kirsch Castilla, so don't go nowhere. Oh, we back? Yes, we are back. All right. 
I, I'm saying I, I'm back. Uh, anyway, so I prepped tonight with a little bit of a surprise. I, I've done this before. Yes, we are back. All right. I, I'm saying I, I'm back. Uh, anyway, so I prepped tonight with a little bit of a surprise. I, I've done this before on Hawker Friday, but since Hawker Friday is partially inspired by Game Center CX. Uh, I've got one of my one of those uh, Kobayashi cooling pads that I'll be applying to my forehead to uh, um, You know stay cool and uh, Stuff because Not that I have a headache. Well, I'm maybe a little one, but uh, you know, I need absolute mint concentration So I'm gonna stick one of these bastards on my Where did I buy them? Oh my my, my local um, pharmaceutical place actually has them so Oh, that's cool there. All right, I'm re-energized, man. I'm re-energized. I'm ready to rock and roll once again. Here we go. Whew. Okay. You have to excuse the content of the keyboard, but um, don't know how to really silence that. All right. Uh, Anyway, uh, have you guys tried the, this is only uh, only people in Europe can answer this maybe I don't know but have you tried the new Doritos that is called flaming hot? They don't mess around uh, we, I've never had like really hot Doritos before but man they don't fuck around Yeah, I, I know new uh, for you guys like what new but we're really behind in the rest of the world I think people in the UK also just got flaming hot, you know I don't really know why I did that, but... But they're pretty damn hot. Usually, like, grocery store hot, quote-unquote. It's just like... You can just drink it like milk. <laughs> but, yeah, it doesn't mess around. And I like it. I like it. Flaming Hot has always been in the UK. Oh, really? Well, we just got them in Sweden. We only have three flavors of the readers in Sweden. And they took away my favorite, which is um, Cool American. Which is what Ranch is called here and in Sweden. But they took that away, and I had to just resort back to, uh, like, well, the, the three flavors we have is uh, nacho, uh, paprika, and chili. Uh, like sweet chili. And uh, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much it. But now they have uh, goddamn flaming hot, and it's, it's pretty damn good. Okay, yeah. Uh. I like really, really spicy food. But I don't really have a high, like, heat tolerance when it comes to spicy food. I just like pain. <laughs> I know the, the CBT joke is in there, but it's true. Love that shit, too. That was on me, though. That was on me. Ooh! Okay, extra lifetime, please. Uh, there we go. Uh, nice! Ooh! Well, actually... Actually, you know what? Yeah, I'm gonna go with the sickle. Am. am I a fucking masochist? Well, obviously, because I enjoy really spicy food and I love shit like this, so... <laughs> I must be. See, you know, you know, you know why like, pain is good in, like, food and stuff like that? It makes you feel alive. <laughs> it reminds me that you're alive, you're like, oh yeah, life isn't that great. <laughs> Okay. There we go. Ooh, I am dead serious when I say this. I hit jump instead of my intended attack instead. Okay, that is not good. That is not good. Okay. Yeah, I can actually stand down here and do it, but ah, uh, you know, it, it's fine. It's fine. There 
we go. Uh, <laughs> get flaming hot Cheeto dust on your eyes and touch your eyes. That'll be funny. That, that, that's the feeling of playing this game. Hot Cheeto dust in your eyes. And you know what? It really is like getting daggers instead. Oh god, I, I have the worst weapon in the game right now. Th this weapon is so bad. It, it does the least amount of damage. But it just has more range, which is like... Not that good anyway, so... Oh, God! Ah! <laughs> Reset. You know what? That is a good idea. Blah. Died too many times, man. Unnecessary. We're gonna be here all night. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Okay. Still kicking ass. How many resets? I think it's four. I think we reset it four, four times at this point. Here we go. That, oh, well, you know what? Uh, holy fire! Yes. Uh, and I can just skip through this. Uh. Okay. Ooh, I didn't see that knife coming, man. Well, I saw it coming, but I didn't do anything about it. I still say this. This game is is. Um, less hard than the original Ghost and Goblins for NES. So. Like that, that game is just fucked. Too. But I feel like a lot of it's just bad. That game, it, it's kind of like <laughs> the problem with that game is that it was made by really inexperienced um, developers at the time. I think it's Micronix who did the uh, the developing on it, and it just it has a bad frame rate. Like I don't know, it's 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 not not the greatest NES game. It, it's a classic, but but I don't know, man. It's yeah yeah. Trust me, I, I played I played the full run. I I know the pain. You know what else? A game was made by like really inexperienced people, and it's it's really cute. The original Double Dragon for NES. It's the port is kind of bad, and it's just full of bad glitches. And you can't even play as two players. So. Sequel is much better, but uh, yeah. The creator behind this game, uh, what's his name? Loco Malito. He has done. Um, uh, Castlevania game as well, so he's done a bunch of like tribute e games, and this is one of them. But I, I feel like this game really transcends just being a tribute. You know what I mean? Like it, it feels like how should I put it? It's his, it's its own game with its own gameplay merits. I'm sure, it might be inspired and all that, but I don't know, man. Uh, It's not a bad weapon for this, actually. Yeah. <laughs> you see where I'm trying to throw the weapon? Alright. There we go. Yeah. So that new Battletoads game isn't that uh, good, huh? That sucks, man. Uh, how long since, has it been since there's been a new Battletoads game? I mean, uh, I, I get I get no pleasure when, when games are bad, when people are like, ha ha ha, it's so bad. I'm just like, I'm just sad that like fans have waited so long and it's just kind of blech, you know. Uh,
It's extremely mixed. It's fine, Joel. Uh, I might have to give it a try and see what I what I think, but um, but um, you know what? I, you know what's a game that I feel nobody ever talks about, and it, it is a Battletoads game. This NES game. I played a bunch of that on an emulator like a million years ago. Yeah, Battletoads arcade as well. They made a SNES game, yeah, they did. Okay, yeah. Uh... You need to change your channel icon? Oh, you mean the uh, the PCRF logo? Yeah, I know, I know. But I kind of don't want to because it, it, it's... It's nice to have it because it's it's saying, hey, I participated in charity, you know? You know what I mean? Like, I don't want to take that off. It's like, limited a skit about this, the, um, the awareness bands that people have. And then they take him off eventually. Like, that, no, don't take them off. Should always be there. Should always wear a awareness band if that's the case, you know? <laughs> okay. Ooh. All right. Have I died yet? I, 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 I've been too, like, stressed to keep up if, if I've died. Have I? No. Okay. Okay, I just want double jump. That's all I want. What kind of creature is, like, born into the world? And the first thing it knows is just kill. <laughs> Like, without hesitation. Yeah, I have no concept of time or anything. I'm just... Murder. <laughs> Me. Okay, I'll take the sickle, please. Ooh, we don't want that. We don't want that. Ant lines for real? Really, yeah. <laughs> I don't know why I think the concept is funny, like... You know how, how a baby or a kitten, like, the first thing they do is just, like, they scream and they're like, Oh, no! No, the... So, antlions, they're born into the world. First thing they do is just... Murder. Okay, yeah. Sharks eat their siblings when they're born. Uh, nature's crazy, man. Uh, okay, concentration. Uh. Ooh, <laughs> I got a little greedy there, huh? Yeah, we don't want to do that. Yeah, whatever. Uh. See now, now that I've warmed up a little, bit, ooh, you, 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 you. better shut my fucking mouth. <laughs> See, every time I, I'm like, it will be really bad if I died here, like, ah, this boss is easy. Every time it's some shit like that, it's just horrendous comedic death. <laughs> you know? Okay, shut your mouth. 
Zip it. Zip. You know, easier that way. Badass. All right, uh, plague dance. Uh, Oh, come on, I hit him. Oh, at least I got some extra life. That's all we need. Whew, that makes me happier. But it doesn't... It doesn't... Uh, it doesn't... Uh, make me sleep good at night. Would ever consider doing a Hawker Friday of the Mega Man Legacy Collection? Like, all the games? Because that's like seven games, isn't it? But more, isn't it? Okay, I'll, t I'll, t I'll tell you, I will do it for one. I will do it on one condition. You give me two Scooby Snack. <laughs> Deal. <laughs> too much. Okay, I really want to redo my Mega Man Harker fight I did like a thousand years ago because I did the, um, the, uh, the, uh, what, what's his name? The, uh, the, the, the Cyclops, uh, yellow dude. I did the pause trick on him because I was lazy and I feel like I shouldn't do that. Uh, it's a yellow devil, right? Uh, yes. Uh, yeah, I, I kind of, I kind of shat, shat out at him and I, I shouldn't have done that. Okay, we don't need to go down there at this point, so... Uh, Okay. Whee! I'm fine. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, no, I'm good. I'm good with that too. Joel, I bet you can't do a Hawker Friday of the first two fifths of the North Star Famicom games. You watch me. You keep you keep you keep daring me to the stupid shit. And eventually it'll go from like, you won't play this shitty game, Joel, and I'll be like, oh yeah. And like several years down the line be like, Joel, guess what? I bet you won't uh, take this 12 gauge shotgun and like blast your balls. I'd be like, oh yeah? And he's just, I'm like, ha ha ha! You guys got owned! Ooh! And you guys are like, damn, he really is gamer. <laughs> How's people get owned? <laughs> no ball streamer! <laughs> Shut up! Shut up! Okay. You know, if I had a double jump, I could have easily gotten that extra life, but uh, whatever. Too late for that shit now. Alright, quit. Ooh, that was close. Is there anything on this wall, I wonder? Nah, whatever. Okay, see, this, this is much easier to do. When you have a weapon that isn't dog shite. By the way, you see this pattern that's going on with the enemies appearing and stuff? Do you think that's stressful? Last level of the game, they quadruple the, the amount of shit that's on screen. And there's just enemies spawning and spawning and spawning and spawning and spawning. It doesn't stop. Nice. Okay. I'm wearing, uh, if you're just tuning in, I'm wearing the Game Center CX Kobayashi uh, cooling headache migraine pad on your uh, on my head. It's great, except it keeps kind of like slipping off a little bit. Not not that it's not enough ad adhesive, but I'm a very emotive person with my eyebrows. <laughs> when I'm like saying stuff, it's just like, imagine the actor in, in Silent Night, Deadly Night 2, you know, garbage day. That guy, that's how I look when I talk. So it's like... 
going wee oo wee oo wee oo on my forehead. Wait, what the fuck? Are you, are you seeing what I'm seeing? Uh. I got a little glitch there. Bah. <laughs> ah, outstanding! Outstanding idiot! Okay. Let's see, what, what weapon do I want? Uh, that doesn't really matter, does it? Uh, what's well, a Manticore after this, so... Um, Joel, what's my favorite Metal Gear character? Um, can I be very specific? This, this, I don't know if this is going to make any sense. Naked Snake in 3. By extension, Big Boss. But only in 3. Because sometimes I, I, I feel it's hard to uh, associate the character with what he becomes later on. In 3, he's just, he's just kind of like... You know, good guy and all that, but... Uh, the key? I've already got the tier, haven't I? Uh, I guess, I guess, uh, what I'm trying to say here, I, I really enjoy the all of Three's cast uh, with Paramedic and everybody, and I feel the whole team and the chemistry that they have is just, I love that. I love the, the Codex calls and all that stuff, so... You know, so I get, I guess by, 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 I mean, like all of them, but I mean, that's not, that an answer. I mean, all right. <laughs> Yay! The fun! I could have really avoided that fucking skeleton. Why the fuck did I interfere with him? <laughs> he was just <laughs> minding his own business. <laughs> Why the hell would I do that? It's like, what the hell? It's like, it's like seeing a hornet's nest a mile away. I'm like, yeah, you know what? I'm gonna poke that. Why? Why did I do that? <laughs> God damn it! Oh, so unnecessary, man. Come on. Oh no! Oh no! Bad pattern. I'm sort of like get get too quick with my actions here because I want to like make up for my time wasted, <laughs> so I'm just playing like an idiot. Well, I'm always playing like an idiot, but you know what I mean. Okay, yeah. Okay, okay. Do you ever, do you ever just beat games because you feel like they've, they've insulted you personally? Like, it's no longer just about the challenge or the, the fun of the challenge. It's more so like, fuck this game, and you take no enjoyment out of actually beating it. <laughs> it's just kind of despite the game and be like, yeah, well, fuck you too. Like, there, there's zero enjoyment in what you're doing. See, th this skeleton we gotta deal with, but not the one on the ceiling, damn it. <laughs> Why waste your limited time? See, I ask that myself a lot, but a game like this, I'm actually... I mean, it's hard to believe that I am actually having fun. Um, but some games... used to feel like they personally insulted me to a point where I... I can't accept the game existing. So I just have to, like, prove how bad it is... by beating it. Nay! <laughs> oh! I have, I have a lot of trouble with the Manticore here. The Manticore. Hat. I'm not having a lot of trouble, trouble with them. I'm doing fine. Oh, come on, man. So bad when you're like, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Now it's fine. Ugh. I'm gonna do something crazy. I'm gonna go for the chest, too. 
right here. Okay, whatever. Go! Go, man, go! And don't stop! Yikes. Go, 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 go! The Fruit Loops. Okay. Now, if I can, if I can keep this weapon uh, for Kyori, Kyote, Kyori, Kyote, and keep it for subsequent levels, that will be wonderful. But then again, I, I need to get the uh, the other thing as well. Don Kyote. That's a spicy meatball, please. Okay, we gotta get this too. Again, for super good ending, you need all these random items. Uh, Quixote! Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Well, I'm doing excellent. I probably do this on one life anyway. <gasps> Where can I? I'm gonna find out tonight. It's fine, I actually have, have that. Okay, yeah. Uh... Ooh, okay. <sighs> Alright, boys. Let's get him. <sighs> there's, a, there's a bad spot for these knives! Oh! Mmm, the books. Brah, friends. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh. Okay, I'm just gonna stand here and, like, not care about that, too. Oh, come on, man. You're already dead! Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, no. Disaster. Disaster. Disaster! Disaster! There has been a critical disaster in town center. Which is my life. Uh-oh. You ran into that, man. <laughs> I walked into it. Okay. In <laughs> Lego City. Okay, we're doing it the hard way. These fucking axes, I hate them. Ooh. Okay, here comes the books. People got hurt, man. Okay, yeah. Another one, please. Um, all right. Uh, if I get an extra life after this, that will be wonderful. And full life too. Woo! I don't know how I managed to avoid that, but okay, avoid the ceiling now. Uh, all right, sweet. Paper cuts are actually deceptive, deceptively deep. Do you ever just like find out you're bleeding from a, like a bad cut and you have no idea where you've gotten it? Like, like you, you can just be like walking in public. Like, what the fuck is this? And it's like you, there's been no like kitchen utensils. There's been like no random insect or anything like that. It's just like, why am I bleeding? shouldn't have gotten this because I need the fire sword. Uh, you know what? Whatever. You know what? I'm gonna not be able to keep that fire sword anyway because I, I know I'm gonna die on turtle, so whatever, man. <laughs> oh, I hate bolas. Uh, bolas is just slightly better swords. Okay, huh?
sickle is, is my favorite weapon in this because it, it, it fires fast and it comes back, so it's it's great. <laughs> Cracker volley. Oh my god, I just realized something. I need to do this. In order for me to even get the best ending, I need to invoke the Lady of the Lake. I need to do this. I need to do this. I mean, I, I don't. I, I wouldn't need to like get the sword, right? To... I can just like uh, invoke the Lady of the Lake without a fucking hell. Okay. Uh... Ah, uh, wing, wang, bada bada bang bang, okay. There we go. <sighs> At least is that, that's activated, isn't it? Damn it! Hello! Hello! Uh oh. <laughs> You know what? Fire sword time. Let's see if I can keep it. It's a good weapon. It's a, maybe the best weapon in the game. Okay. I love the music in this stage. Okay. It's very nice. Uh, All right, here we go, fire sword. No, 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 no funny deaths, please. Ooh, I just ate that chicken and I, ah, oh, whatever. Okay, yeah. Monkey, I'm monkey. I'm monkey. I'm monkey. Oh god. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine, monkey. Yeah. Hello, my name is Mr. Gorilla. Okay. Can you? Okay. Can Can everybody in chat just say like you're not gonna fuck this up, Joel? For encouragement. I need, I need, uh, no, no, wait, don't say that, because I, I, now, now there's, uh, now there's going to be too many people, and now it's going to feel condescendingly, now it's going to feel like there's a wave of sarcasm, like a, like a tornado of sarcasm is going to shoot up my bum, and I'm going to be like, whoop, and I'm going to, like, lift up, like, 500 meters in the sky and just land on my ass. I just know it. Now it... <laughs> Mamma de mia! Approciotto! Mamma mia! A bambino! Mario! I need to not hurt the mermaids because that is the requirement for the super good ending which I'm trying to get now. Um, careful now. We don't want to have an accident. We don't want to have funnyaccident.com. <laughs> ah! Jesus, do you see how close that was? Okay. 
Don't get Chad any ideas. Pretty smooth. I do pretty good at the, against the turtle, man. I, 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 not too bad. All right, now, are you willing to bet that I'm gonna fuck this up? Uh oh. Okay. Well, I have a good weapon ag against the 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 pyramid of shit that is being built up upon my corpse. Uh, See if you if you crush the rocks here with a rock, I must. Um, you can't even get up. Okay, this time the, the, the dude who nailed my head with a spear, spear. I'm gonna. Okay. Ooh, that was close. Okay, King is a mass now. Okay, no, we don't, we don't, we don't want that. We don't want you in my house. God oh, damn! I'm gonna chill out a little bit, you know. Just chill out. Okay, okay. I even have the crystal ball. This, this, this might be a very good run. <laughs> oh god. Oh, the yo I just got I just fucking did it. Here they are. Secret. Here they are. The Gamusin people. See, they're they're happy. They're vibing. But you need the crystal ball to do that. Oh yeah. Time limit. Cool, huh? Ah, yes, don't even... Okay. You want me to do this in eight seconds? Sure thing, buddy. Holy shit, I might actually be able to do it. Holy fuck, I did it. Holy fuck, I did it. Don't kill me now! What the fuck? No, 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 no! God damn, man! I don't know there's probably some time time plays I can get gotten earlier, but uh, all right. Well, we're doing it the hard way then. Uh, it was a cruel king, yes. But hey, no, no continues. Uh, haven't done that yet, so. Okay, now this is this boss is all about patience. And if I have none, I will suffer a lot too. <laughs> Which I have very zero patience anyway, so Okay. It's all about taking it slow. As slow as you possibly can. Okay, yeah. <laughs> what a dodge! What a dodge! It was gonna like activate inside my soul, man. <gasps> I hate how he despawns as you're throwing shit at him. 
Now get greedy now. You're not getting greedy now as I do these like suicide jumps almost. Oh! I also like to live dangerously. Okay, yeah. Uh, don't spawn in me, please. No, 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 no. Uh, am I playing with a keyboard? Why? This is gonna sound bizarre, but I actually think the gamepad slows me down. Like, I get more of an, a hard, like, left, up, down, like... I don't know. Um, and I rarely, I rarely, I really, like, always play with a gamepad, but this game, I don't know why, it's, like, more precise this way. <laughs> Uncaged gamer. Our bonus stage. I'm not doing super good. With the power. Oh, no, I missed all of them. Oh, this is terrible. Oh, no. I could have got the bonus! Oh, shit! Oh! Well, I just gotta not die, ever. Damn it, that good on. Oh, no, man. Oh, hell. Flubbed it up. Flubbed it up. This is funny. These enemies, sometimes in the game, you will have enemies that just appear for one section of the game. <laughs> These dudes are just here in this level. Don't appear again. Okay. Is there bonus level levels later on? Uh, there is the bonus level, which is like kind of hell and spelunky, if that makes any sense. Um, and it's the, the it's the real ending, so to say. Uh, is the fire sword also required for the the mega golden ending? No, 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 no. It isn't. Uh, Even if I fuck up one of the golden ending things, I'm still gonna go for the good ending. I'm not gonna like reset the run for that at this point. Because uh, I feel like it, it, it's too much for the night to get super, super, super good ending. I'll try, but uh, <laughs> you know, I won't succeed. Alright, let's get over the Eggman thing. Ooh, I don't like that. Uh, I'm glad I don't land on the spider head. Ooh, okay. Don't get hit by the rock now. Okay. These ranges are like straight out of Mario. <gasps> Three! So I, I know why I died last time on this guy. Or one of the, the times. It's like my... My, um, my sickles don't reach. Yeah. Fuck it, just, just get him. Oh, now he doesn't wanna... Okay, now he takes a nap, okay. <sighs> Would you say this game is stressful, chat? <laughs> Come on, son. <laughs> Dear God! Oh! I didn't see where I was going. Oh! Music does not help in this game. <laughs> Go. Oh! I gotta change my tra trajectory. That's no, fine. It's fine. Oh! Like every every hit uh, in this game feels right in the balls. It doesn't matter. First continue in the run. No, two? No, okay, I thought it did two already. Okay. I 
Actually, you know what? I just, I just remembered uh, for super super good ending. You can't even use one continue. <laughs> I think some shit like that. So <laughs> I don't think we can get it anyway. I'm not I'm not 100 sure, but <laughs> we, well, I mean we'll see we'll see. Oh come on. I feel I'm always like one pixel off in the hitbox. That's what's killing me. Oh, that was good dodge though. Okay. For the ultimate, and you can't even get hit points. I mean, there are, there are people that play this game like that. <laughs> Watch Joey put the best, best standing up on YouTube. No, I'm, I'm gonna give it a serious try. Huh? Did I, ha did I have a uh, double jump on this part last time? I, I forgot. Did, did I? <laughs> like, you stressed out to think. It, it's insane. Yes. Oh, there it is. I, I ate shit there, and I, I walked into it. I was, like, inviting that kind of shit in my life. Oh, I can turn around. I forgot about that. This music falls. This music sounds like you're about to fall over when you're listening to it. Which is, I guess, the the intention, you know. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Drug music. Vertigo music. I would say so. Yeah, yeah. I guess I should take my time with these. Ceiling slimes. Oh, what the fuck? I thought I dodged that. Yeah, very spelunky music, I agree with that. Crazy jump. Uh, I need no bolas, please. There we go. Okay. Whew. Okay, here we go. Oh, Lord. Oh, fuck. This is gonna be way easier if I'm just allowed a second to, like, think about what the fuck I am doing. Hello. Wait, and fuck, I swear to God, that's slightly homing. <laughs> I guess it's homing because I'm running ahead and it's also like, oh man. Ooh, that sucked. Okay, yeah. Uh... Slightly homing. I know it's not, but it feels that way. Okay. We have the dancing skeleton coming up here. Oh, shit. Shit. Oh, an Alaskan bullworm.
Oh, I swear he told me. Oh, you know what? That guy, I didn't take that. Oh, 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 oh. oh no. I try to get out of there. I try to get out of there. Ah. Open your mouth. I'm also getting like too greedy. That's a problem. <laughs> Okay, careful now, careful now. So time limit in this game. Oh wait, there is. Okay, I think I have them. Yes, 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 early death. They fuck up now and it's just ridiculous. Whew. Okay, now he's gotta wait for the king's speech and then, then we're good. I implore you to reconsider. I wonder if there's anything up here I can... Ah, uh, whatever. Whew. She came here right to go against Ella. Oof. Can't steal it. But look at me now. I like that line, how God paid a servant. <laughs> if you're underprepared for that, then it's just... Come on. Okay. <sighs> Big sip. Big sip. Does this game have Satan? It literally does have, has Satan at the very end. That's the last boss. Just, just Satan. Just Satan. Spoilers. Uh, what do you think was gonna happen? I mean, come on. Just some guy with a sword? No. Mr. Kill. Okay, now, if I knew if there was any more secrets in this level, I would love to have that knowledge, but I do not. Oh, God, that box! Okay. Fine, I'll take it. Too. Wait, why, why did I take that? That's like the worst weapon for this boss. <sighs> Whatever. Whatever, man. Whoop. True, I need it for the elevator, though. I like this frog here. What's more? More meme house? No, we, we, meme house has, has ended. The season finally. Okay. <gasps> uh oh. Uh oh. Stinky. Hello. Okay. Will I be picking up Yakuza Zero at some point? Some point, yes. But first, I want to finish Vista of the North Star and Shenmue and stuff like that. So, uh, God, if I had double jump, I'd love to get up there. Uh, Okay. Okay. And fuck the mermaids! Fuck the mermaids! God damn! Listen. 
I care about him. <laughs> ah, yes. Perfect. Did I die at the very fucking same spot last time in this continue area? I think I, I think I did. I think I did. <laughs> he dootin' and he tootin'. Shit. Okay. Okay. 48. My name is... Uh, how do I type? How does one type in this game? Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, Oh, it, oh, it's caps lock. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> All right, let's go again. My name Dole. My name is Dole. Isn't Dole like a company max the max juice? Or like pineapple or something. <laughs> Dole and bananas, yeah. You guys ever like drank pineapple juice in a can straight? Because you had nothing else to drink at home? Like there was no soda, so you just take like pineapple juice in a can, like. Uh -uh. Awful time soon. Pineapple juice is delicious, though. No, I mean, uh, here's the thing. Uh, yes. But when you're really thirsty and when you drink, like, an orange juice, you just get more thirsty. It's it's not very uh, thirst-quenching. It's like drinking a Sprite, you know? It's like Sprite's tasty, but it makes you more thirsty. It's like, it's like a beer as well. Okay. Well, we're back here at square one again. <laughs> All right. Uh, try canned coconut water. Helps me at least. Oh, uh, well, coconut water is pretty good. But I have a better idea. Instead of coconut water, it's gonna be a crazy opinion. How about just water? <laughs> Honestly, though, uh, I, I gotta be honest, sometimes I'm not just craving water, uh, I'm also craving carbonated water, which is like, I want that fizziness. And um, if you want a little tip for me, uh, um, little, little old Joel, uh, um, I don't like I don't like the Soda Stream fake cola flavors and stuff like that that they do. You know, like Soda Stream Dr. Pete and shit like that. What I do instead with my Soda Stream, I just use it to carbonate regular boring water just for the carbonation. I don't care about the flavor. I just want the uh, the boobies. And if I really want if I really want some like extra flavor, I, I'm oh no. I'll take like a slice of lemon, but uh, I did I do that same mistake last run. I think I did. Okay, I bungled it. Yeah. <laughs> yep. You guys ever like been so bored that you fuck around with the soda stream, you like carbonate milk and stuff like that? I mean, I don't do that now, but when I was a little younger, I'm like, dude, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Get the Nobel Peace Prize and do some shit nobody's ever thought of. Carbonated chocolate milk. They called me a madman. 
Then see <laughs> my genius unfold. Carbonation and chalky milk. I have created. Uh. Cummy milk. <laughs> No, Eggman, no! Okay. Okay, I'm, I'm just focusing what's above here. When I should be focusing what's below as well, huh? Mixing seven up with milk was a thing in the past? Where? On the moon? What? Seven up in milk? Are you like fucking around here like, Joel, that slang for semen! He 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 he! Joel, you're stuck in all age semen on stream! He he he! Sperm! He he! Except you guys are like that. Uh. Don't know about Kalpus? Yeah, yeah. I've, I've had uh, Kalpus and Pokori sweat in Japan. People of the Aztec Empire did that. What, 7-Up and Milk? Yeah. Uh-huh. No, they use Sprite. Ah, okay. They didn't have... <laughs> they didn't have 7-Up back then. They used Sprite instead. Ah, okay. 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 <laughs> okay. That's hard science, man. You can't you can't debate that. Okay. Ah, uh, you know. Caveman did that too. Huh? You, you you ever think about who the first like caveman <laughs> caveman who who discovered the effect of being drunk? I, 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 it must have been like some some Fred Flintstone in a cave who ate like fermented berries and said, "You know what?" This tastes awful, it makes me sick. I want more. <laughs> yeah, this potato is, is wacky, it's kind of funky. It's making me dangerously sick. This is awesome. Animals do that, they do, they do. During like springtime here or fall, there's instances of little like birdies who literally crash into windows. I've talked about this before, but you ever seen that image of, of uh, there's a bird midway through a, a glass window saying, heard you were talking shit? That's what happens here when birds see too many like fermented um, lingonberries and stuff. Uh, they fly drunk and they smash into like windows and they're just stuck there. It's like, okay. Bird stuck. Haven't died yet, but I could have. I could have. I, I could have gone with that uh, extra life. Uh, okay, we're having a little too much shit on screen right now. <gasps> no! Fucking hell! Oh. So, um, you know those Korean hot noodles? Uh, you know, the, the ones that are like insanely hot and make sure have lipstick on you, almost? So I went to the, um, the import store that we have here, and I usually buy a b bunch of them, and I really like, they're super tasty, but they fuck, they're spicy. Bulldog, yeah, that's what they're called. Anyway, uh, they are now doing rip-offs of the same brand. With a similar looking chicken on it. And there's several bootleg brands <laughs> of this super nuclear hot chicken. And I bought a, I bought like all of them to try them all out, because I had nothing better to do. No, not little, not little. Okay. 
They're not that hot. Have you tried the two X spicy ones? It's like it's like taking a, the sun and putting it into a sandwich, and it's like, here, take a bite. <laughs> okay, bro. <laughs> You want to know how to really tackle hot food? Uh, I, ha I have a technique. Don't even drink milk. Yeah. Honestly, because it, it, it's a it's a state of mind where the pain is so overbearing. Just close your eyes and be like, breathe in, breathe out. And it just subsides eventually. But as soon as you start drinking milk, you're going to be like, more milk, milk, milk. Just, just, just embrace the, uh, the mouth CBT, you know? Okay, yeah. Oh. Okay, yeah. You guys ever, like, given your friend, like, super hot sauce and you've been, like, you've been sneaky about it? Like, hey, bro, yeah, it's a little hot. <laughs> it's just some, some like, Ghost pepper donkey sauce or some shit like that And they're like holy fuck what the hell and you're like it's not that spicy Okay, <laughs> they died Hey accident -y. No, because I'm not an asshole Well, I'm gonna tell you something You're not the asshole Because those hot sauces make you, your your at your asshole will pop off when you eat one. I've never had butthole butthole pain, but those those ramen noodles literally make your 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 Uranus the sun. Nice English, Joel. Well, I can't speak English. I only took a couple of uh, lessons in grade school. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Great English. <laughs> can, can we start doing a thing? <laughs> Whenever I say some really stupid shit that doesn't make too much sense, can you guys just respond with bad English? <laughs> just, just bad English. <laughs> 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 oh fuck! Oh damn! I'm not paying attention. Uh oh. Okay, <laughs> that will be the entire stream. <laughs> Get out of here! Get out of here! Bad English. My bad England. Okay. <laughs> nice job, Joel. I see you're learning more basic English words every day. <laughs> okay. You know what I hate? This is a very specific thing. I don't like it when you like... You're, 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 like, I don't know, school or something sets you up to talk to more people. And it's like a, it's a basic, like, interaction thing with other people where, like, talk about your family with somebody else in, like, in a language you don't fully master yet. And you end up just lying because you don't want to actually tell a bunch of strangers, like, yeah, my, 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 my dad drives a monster truck and he just drove through a hospital destroying it and now he's in jail. So you're just like, uh, yeah, my dad fisherman. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, you don't want to, you don't want to tell them what actually is going on. So you're just like, yeah, my mom is a baker. When she's actually like, uh, I don't know, a, a Sumerian demon. <laughs> nice English Joel. <laughs> Come on. Yes. Yes. 
Hey, Joel, I'm going to try out Curious About Mortal Shell. Yes, actually, Mortal Shell looks awesome. I talked about it uh, a couple of streams ago. Uh, Have you ever been in that situation where, like, it's some something innocent and they expect you to talk about yourself and it's like, I don't really want to because it's, it's going to ruin the mood? Like, <laughs> like, what did you do as a kid? Oh, I, I was in a... I was in a, in a giant tube. <laughs> I, I got trapped in a, in a tube, in a lab. <laughs> and I got dismembered, so... Uh, <laughs> it's like an AI dungeon story. Yeah, uh, yeah, I got in a horrible accident, but a local <laughs> science, science team put me back together in, in the tube for 50 years. <laughs> And then, and like a giant pickle, they regrew my limbs over time. <laughs> and you're like, yeah, I I play with ball. <laughs> I when I when I, <laughs> uh, my cat named Billy, and <laughs> uh, big soccer. Okay. <laughs> they want to tell him, but you also feel bad for lying. So it's like, what the fuck? Speak English. <laughs> you say you have diarrhea. <laughs> you say you have diarrhea. <laughs> yeah, but th no, no, th that excuse does not apply because you're talking about yourself at this point. What the hell? <laughs> Hello, my name is uh, Bob. What is your name? Yuel. What do you like to do, Yuel? Excuse me, diarrhea. Like. That is not that is that is in English. That is not English. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what are you talking about? At least you excuse yourself. Yeah, but what if you don't? <laughs> Hello, my name uh Robert. What is your name? <laughs> no. Bathroom. <laughs> okay, you, you can tell that I'm like getting slightly unfocused on this, which is bad, but. Okay. <laughs> what is your name? No. Oh god, that was close. <sighs> okay, hey, here we go. <laughs> what is your name? Bad English. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Sink. <laughs> Have I, have I ever told you about the Bruce Lee ice cream? Surely I've talked about Bruce Lee ice cream before, haven't I? Uh, no, okay. Well, this is gonna be a complicated story, and it might not be that funny, especially if you are a non-Swedish uh, speaker. Um, but I'll tell you again, I, I might have told this, but... Um, they used to, uh, you know, the Bruce Lee movies and all that, it used to be on VHS in the 90s and all that. But, like, on TV. But one of the funniest mistranslations or like oopsies they ever did in the subtitle. So the Swedish word for ice cream is G L A S S, glass, right? Um, <laughs> and the Swedish word for glass, like window glass, is G L A S, gloss. And I forgot which movie this is. It might be Enter the Dragon or Way of the Dragon or whatever. And he's... <laughs> he's beating down this dude and he's stuffing his mouth full of, like, paper. And he threatens him and goes, Next time it's gonna be... Glass. And whoever did the subtitles for the Swedish version fucked up and wrote, Next time it's gonna be G-L-A-S. S. As in the English one. Which becomes, Next time it's gonna be ice cream. Well, that's not, not that bad. <laughs> bad English. Yeah. 
<laughs> Yum. Okay. <laughs> he was lactose intolerant. Ah, uh, okay. Is it lactose intolerancy? I don't know what the word it would be, but I feel that's like a relatively new thing. I mean, I know it isn't, but I mean, more so in the sense of like when I grew up, I didn't hear anybody like be lactose intolerant. I feel like now that I'm an adult, it's like, oh, you know, there's a lactose intolerancy thing for like every other person I meet. Like, oh, dude, I don't drink milk. I'm like, oh, okay. I guess we're just more more knowledgeable about it, but uh, did, did I use a continue already? I, I can't tell. Did I? I? I did, didn't I? Yes. Okay. Well, there's no continues in this game where you can like find new ones. You see, you know, uh, may, maybe at uh, a score, maybe I, I don't know. No idea. Uh, Wrong kind of weapon for this, by the way, but... Fuck the bolas. <laughs> Joel is English tolerant. Excuse me? And you guys say that I speak ba bad English. I mean, God. God. <laughs> English... Intolerant. Okay, yeah. <laughs> okay, okay. There we go. Oh shit, I didn't see the item there before. Oh, look at that! No idea that was going on. I'll take that. You know, the, 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 the bolus might actually be... Good here, huh? Okay. Yep. You know what I haven't done in a very long time? Taking the bus somewhere. I, I don't like being on a bus or public transport in general. Because I always feel very trapped in there. Like, I I if there is a commodity happening, you're stuck being there, and there's no escape. It's kind of like being on the train. Like, if there's some shit going on, you're like, get me out of there. And you're like, nope, there where the this is where the bus is going. Commodity is not the right word. What, 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 commotion. Commotion. What's a commodity? Commotion. What's a commodity? Bad English. Yeah, I know, but what, is, what does it mean? <laughs> Aware? <laughs> well, well, wh okay, well, well, commodity is like an item. Okay, well, hypothetical situation. You're on the public transport, you're on the bus, and suddenly, like, a man, like, just rips off his, like, pantaloons, and starts, like, just going to town, squatting down, and just leaving a, a commodity on the floor and you want to get off the bus you're like i don't feel comfortable being here and there's a commotion of commodity on the public transport floor <laughs> bad english <laughs> Fuck's sake. Oh yeah, I can... Oh, well, that didn't matter at all, did it? Okay, well, whatever. Oh, you swine! Same weapon? Oh, it was like a split frame from getting... The, uh, okay. <sighs> whatever. Uh, Swine bolas. Okay, yeah. 
<laughs> Welcome to Fico Funny, where the fecal is funny and the English is bad. <laughs> <laughs> Dear God, man. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Not that guy. <laughs> Joe, you're saying comedy wrong. Okay, yeah. I'm not sure what the, the book is a reference to, by the way, but... Uh... Fucking whatever. Ooh. <laughs> that didn't go well, did it? It's Don Quixote's favorite book. Uh, gotcha. I wonder what 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 library's on fire though. But uh... oh fucking hell! I wonder if I have to get it multiple times. Probably yes. Uh... Blasphemous. That's the second time I heard here. Oh, about that game. Uh, I haven't played it yet. No, I haven't played it yet. No. <gasps> Yo, can you please restream? I watched the stream so far. I got late. Okay, boys. Uh, can somebody take the? Uh, <laughs> I was gonna say the um like an old car that is wind up it's like rewind it meow mixon says Joel can I come over my dad said it would be okay I want to remind you all that meow mixon is the person who keeps like speedrun records and he was the one who approved uh, my speedrun record for Pepsi Invaders. <laughs> I forgot the book. Honestly, fuck the book. I mean, there's no way I can do the perfect run anyway, so... Bleh. Bleh. Joel can't read anyway. Can I can I speak Japanese? Uh, I can speak very little Japanese, but enough e enough Japanese to party around in in uh, in Japan late at night with with strangers. Bad Japanese, I would say yes. He might try to... Okay, I am definitely dead here if he does... No, uh, okay, we're good, we're good. Yeah. See, what, see, what I do when I, I speak a foreign language, <coughs> not this one, is I always try to, like, use some metaphors or think... When I can't find the right word for something, I use a lot of my hand shit. Um, uh, and I, I once did a thing... Which is funny in Japanese. Um, sometimes you can just make something sound Japanese and it makes sense. Um, I was going to a concert in 2017 when I was in Japan. I was looking for um, ear earbuds. And I forgot the, the word for, for ears. Is it Mimi? Is that eyes or ears in Japanese? 
and how we, we that that's Mimi yeah yeah Mimi <laughs> anyway but I forgot what it was so what I did I went up to the dude and I I didn't know if this was the right word for like concert <laughs> and I and afterwards, it turns out it was, but I took a 50-50 gamble on it. So what I did, I was like, oh, excuse me. And I, I said, ah, so my son, Korowa, which is like, this is, and I pointed to my ears and I went, ah, concerto. And he's like, oh, I, I know what you mean. And I was like, dude, if I say concerto, and he's like, what the fuck are you talking about? But it turns out that was fucking uh, concert. So, 50-50 <laughs> gambles. I could have been a real idiot about it, you know? But then again, it was pretty much uh, romanianized English, so bad Japanese. All right. I can just say this, but man. Oh god, you, you'll be walking so damn much in Japan if you travel there. Uh, so get good uh, souls if you're gonna if you're gonna go there. It really sucks. It really sucks on, on a serious note, though. Um, I would have loved to have traveled this year uh, somewhere, but you know, you know how shit has been. Uh, so what I what what I do because traveling is expensive. I try every month to put a hundred, basically a hundred dollars after twelve months. So after a year, you can travel with the money you have accumulated from saving a hundred dollars uh, every month. You know, and because you can't do that this year, I'm just like, I don't know what to do with it. <laughs> Tell me what else you do for Christmas. I'll just buy. A shit ton of games just give it all away for you guys. Grimbo! We did, we did that last year. We did that last year, and it was funny. I did the giveaway, and I was like... Uh-oh. Well, fuck that thing anyway, who cares? Um... um. What was I talking about? Uh, oh yeah, we were, we're doing a giveaway last year about um, Christmas stuff, and on the actual Christmas thing, it was like the day after Christmas or something like that, and I was ready to give it out, and I had like legitimate like stomach stomach issues or something like that. So I was sitting there smiling through my teeth like Christmas, Christmas, and you can tell like I was super like not into it. And I'm like, oh man. Okay. I was just like, Let, let's let's raffle away the games, and then uh, then I need to take like something for my for my stomach. If you could, where would you wanna go visit? Uh, you remember how I said. I'd rather not tell the truth because it's too much. So I'd just be like, uh, the moon. <laughs> On a, nah, seriously, um, I don't know where I actually would like to visit, but uh, something really cliche. I'd love to visit Hawaii. Um,. This sounds dumb, but I just want to be like alone on an island with the beach and just be like, oh god. Basically, as far away as from technology as possible. But you know what the worst thing would be? I probably request that my phone is with me on the beach anyway, so I'd just like, yeah, I can't really detoxify from this shit, really. Ah, oh, come on! Bleh! Alaska. Okay, um. I honestly would like to, uh. I'd, lo I'd love to visit, um, Mongolia too, because I I'm actually quite infatuated with, um, Mongolian history. I have a ton of books in my library about it, but. So I'd love to actually do that. 
get some Mongolian soup in me and uh, all that stuff. Uh, okay. Okay, we're fine. Uh, have you heard of Dusk? I streamed Dusk when it was in early access, but I haven't played the full game on on stream yet. No, 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 no. Joel has a library? No, I have a tiny little bookshelf, and I call it my library because it's one of those, uh, I don't know, limited word uses. Bad English, perhaps? And I, f I, feel, I feel better when I say my library because I have so much shit in my bookshelf. It's, it's not only just books. It's 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 a lot of crap. So uh... all right. You know what? Um, I'm I'm gonna say we're not gonna do a perfect run. Let's just do it anyway. Cause why not? Uh... Oh, man, that looks more complicated than it is. Uh, just timing it right. Bye-bye, turtle. Okay, extra time. But we still need to get the tear here, though. We still need to get the tear here. Okay, yeah. Are they still making Turtles cartoons, by the way? I know that's a random question, but someone is mentioning uh, Turtles with the boss. I'm like, okay. Yes, yeah. It's a new series? Yeah. I feel like whenever they make new series that have a different design, I'm not sure who it appeals to. Is it, is it like, it's not old fans, it's trying to have new fans by simplifying the design and redesigning and blah 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 blah. Like, who is this for, man? <laughs> for me, okay. Well, I must have missed that then. Have I played Battletoads? That's like the third time that's been brought up tonight. No, I, I haven't... I haven't checked out the uh, the new game. But a lot of people say like, oh, don't do don't do that and blah, 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 but... Uh... <sighs> Hello. Uh... Alright, leg it. How about Streets of Rage 4? Um... I was thinking of Double Dragon Neon, but that, that's a that's a completely different game. I don't know why I used to remember this, but in my head as we're talking about this, totally irrelevant and has nothing to do with the conversation. But I'm like, you know what's evil? You know what's really evil? When people charge money for like the bathroom. Like public, public toilet. I was in Germany, and to even get in there, you had to like go through one of those like security gates by putting in a quarter. I'm like, why? You do it, Joel. Yeah, but that, I, I know that. You know, that's their decision to go in the park in the first place, anyway. So, I mean, it's their fault. <laughs> Oh, I'm way better this time. We have a, a city, like a community center, city council, big um, house in the middle of town square, right? And it was something that just killed my childhood once. Um, I wondered why is all the bathrooms here like, why, why do they all have blue lights inside? I was like, oh, that's funny. I was like, seven. <laughs> and it turns out 
Um, the reason is why they have blue lights illuminating inside the toilets is because they, they don't want the junkies to find their veins when they're shooting up. And as a kid, I was just like, oh, because it, it's it's a cool, it's a cool light inside. Fuck it, I'm just gonna go to town. I have 10 seconds. It's like horribly depressing, isn't it? Don't do drugs, man. Okay. Have I used to use one container or two? Uh, I used three, two already. Oh, man. Oh, well, so be it. Uh, I can make my Philips blue uh, hue light illuminate blue. You know, I uh, I wanted to buy those for my apartment, but now they went out of fashion and nobody uses them. I mean, they're too expensive too, man. It's one of those things where you just go on eBay and you buy uh, something uh, from like Wish.com or AliExpress. That's where the Wish really is coming from. You know what's fucking crazy? That people don't know what the hell Wish is. Like they think Wish is like some magical website things just come from. From like, oh, do these, these you exist? It's just AliExpress, man, with an app. <laughs> Okay, yeah. AliExpress is great, and I, I should order more stuff from it, because if you want to get some bootlegs and crap, go to AliExpress. You'll, you'll find plenty of, like, NES, NES Famiclones, and, uh, you know, but it's it's quite pricey as well. It's not as cheap as you think it is. Uh. Okay, yeah. So, he's in chat right now, but Karelian lives in, like, the far, far east of Russia, and we we had talked about this, but we might just do a stream where he sends me, like, a real dendy, or, like, Super super Mega Drive 5000, so we can play, like, Mortal Kombat uh, 26 on it. Because I, I don't want to play, I don't want to play like Spongebob, you know, TV plug-in plays. Because that, that's lame. I want like, you know, the real crust. Get him. There we go. Oh boy. There's no rush. It's not time limit or nothing. Oh wait, there he is. This pattern is messing me up. <sighs> okay, where would I get some additional time here? Cause Oh you truck! <laughs> You think I can do a stream? Do you remember in GTA 3? There was a stream I did where I didn't swear once. Uh, ever. Uh, and we're like... <laughs> what, what, what was that about? We, we did something where we just like... Uh, you can't swear, can't swear. And then I like I looked up like in like an urban dictionary like... No, what you said was not a swear. Oh, wanker! Wanker was the word! Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we couldn't. We weren't allowed to say the word wanker, and I I looked up like a alternate definition of it on on Urban Dictionary, and I was like, no. Nope. <laughs> Inspect element. Okay.
The next GTA game I have decided will be uh, 4, by the way. I can't tell you when that's gonna happen, but probably in fall. And... It's kind of a reverse order how I'm playing. I mean, not, not even a reverse order, man. I'm just playing them completely out of... Out of uh, order. I mean, I start with Vice City. I, I go into San Andreas, then 3, then 4. You know... Uh, Why not Vice City Stories? Because I I, 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 I I didn't grow up with that one. I never played it. Okay, this is like giving me anxiety. Okay. Actually, uh, there's a there's an element of GTA 4 that I absolutely hate. And it's the like worst social anxiety game ever. Like that entire game is... No, sorry, I have diarrhea, and you say it, and you feel guilty, because you don't really. Like, seriously, that whole game is all about, like, avoiding social, uh, interaction. <laughs> like, people call you up, and they're like, hey, you wanna hang out? And you're like... Okay. Fucking hell! Like, this run is bad. <sighs> you know, you know, you know how bad my social anxiety in, in those situations is. Um, the, well, there, there was two people in the game you could either kill. Uh, it was like Playboy X or what was the other guy called? Uh, Dwayne. Yeah, Dwayne. <laughs> I actually opted in to kill Dwayne instead, just because if you kill Playboy X, you're stuck with Dwayne being kind of sad and calling you up and be like, Hey man, you want to hang out? And you're like, uh, uh. So I rather took the approach of like, doing the bad choice and killing Dwayne just to not have one person call me up on the phone. Because <laughs> that's how much I hated hanging out in the game. Okay. <laughs> It's awful. <laughs> uh, <laughs> just imagine. <laughs> Couldn't you technically kill uh, some of the friends in the game anyway? Yeah, you can? Okay, just imagine, right? <laughs> <laughs> listen to this. I'm <laughs> oh, fine. Okay, listen to this. Okay, you kill Playboy X. So there's, there's one less person in the game that's even existing. And then you're stuck with Dwayne, who is like calling up and when you're like having fun and game, being like, Hey man, you wanna you wanna hang out? I'm feeling kind of down. And you're like, No, I'm I'm sorry. Here's what you do instead. You say yes. And you show up with a fucking bulldozer and go. <laughs> Just kill him too. <coughs> Not because you're evil. You're like, I don't want to hang out. <laughs> <So horrible. laughs> oh man. Uh, <laughs> not evil. No, it, it's it's just, it's um, oops, it's oopsie. Okay. I don't remember the the story too well. Of four, I remember like not understanding who the villain was or something like that. I, I actually don't remember too much of it. But I was like, oh, we're killing this guy now. Okay. I really gotta say, GTA 5 at least, like, I think the gameplay is fantastic, but it, the, the story is so weak. Like, I didn't, I, I, they should have not gone for the the multi-character thing. I really, like, I really like 5, but I think that was a mistake. Yeah. Oh, nice dodge, yeah. Some people prefer the handling of the cars and stuff in, in 4 to um, in 5 because it's more realistic. 
And five is more of an arcade approach, but... Uh... So what? Straight up. There's no judgment in this, but... What do you prefer? Five or four? Uh... I see people saying four, too. So... Uh... Oh, that was close. You know what I kind of miss, though? That, that I, I don't know if it, it exists in 5, because I didn't play too much of DT online. But simple, like, cops and robbers deathmatch. I thought that was great in, in, in 4 online. There's like a lobby. People are joining up. Boom, let's go. Holy shit, I just pulled that off. Now watch me fuck it up. Really splatter house in this area. I'm trying not to get an extra hit on me here, because that would be bad. Also try to, like, not jump down a pit. Thank God that platform was there. Thank fucking God. Gonna need, uh, yep. Oh, open your mouth. Oh, well, I think it's safe anyway. Sweet. Okay. Don't want to get too overconfident. Uh. Hey, look at that. Look at that. Hurry up. Uh oh. Well, surely you're going to give me a little time before this area, right? You're not going to be. Oh, you are. You are being funny about it, huh? Uh, yeah, I, I, I would like little time, please. Okay, thanks. Yeah. So, like, is he gonna give me a, a, the speech while the game is like, oh, fuck, that's what's inside. <laughs> what do we have there again? Uh, I'll take that. Too. Okay. <laughs> the game gives you a speech until you just die. Is San Andreas my favorite? Well... I think Vice City is still my favorite uh, because I have more nostalgia over that over San Andreas, but I think San Andreas is like the better game. But there's something about the atmosphere of Vice City that I... Untouchable. <sighs> okay. Uh... I, you know, if I didn't take that timer, I would have been dead. He would have given a speech so long, my character would have just gone... You know... The guns of GTA San Andreas suck, yeah. But you know what's very crazy? There's a mod that reinstates Vice City sounds for San Andreas, and it actually sounds off. I guess they were trying to, like, make it sound realistic, but they ended up sounding like, you know, firecrackers. You know, the kind of little things you, like, throw on the, on the floor, and it goes, you know. That's the sound of Vice... Oh, San Andreas, I mean. Unnecessary. Okay, yeah. yeah all right. All right. 
Is this from the same creators from Ghouls and Ghosts? No, no, no. This is this is a this is a tribute to it. And it, this game came out eight years ago, actually. And it's, but it looks very much like a like a retro game, doesn't it? And the music sounds great. And okay. Um... Why did I take the bolas? Well, I'd much rather have bolas than holy fire here anyway, so... What about here? Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Alright. I'll take it. Hey Joel, hot take, SNES or Mega Drive SNES? Uh, I did not, like... I, 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 I don't know, man, I, I... The library of games on SNES is just better. Uh, Mega Drive has a lot of charm, uh, but... I don't know, there's, there's just too many good games on SNES for me to, like, count it out. Uh. You fucking swine again! Uh, fucking same spot! Oh god. Like what? Okay, well, I feel if you enjoy RPGs, uh, SNES is your shit. Like that, 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 that's your jam, man. But if you like arcadey blast games, <laughs> Genesis is more, more up your, you know. You know, I'll take that. Okay, might have to do another run after this. Mega Drive had a lot, had a ton of RPGs. Oh yeah, it did. I'm just saying that they weren't. Not all of them were like as good as like Chrono Trigger. You know. There was some, there was some gems on the Genesis though, but okay. I really need bombs here. I really need bombs. Will I survive though? Well, let's find out. No, no. No, no. Look at this fucking mess. Frog, no. Bombs, you want it? Okay. Um. Don't mess up. Do not mess up. If I get hit by one of these, the run is dead. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Wouldn't it be funny if I messed up? Uh, have I ever tried skateboarding? I, I had a skateboard growing up, but it was like the wrong kind of skateboard. I had one of those like bastards that was like super long and it looked off. It's one of those things where you, you ask your mom, can I please get a skateboard? And she comes home with this like wave board and you're like, thanks. Okay, not the best weapon for this, but I'm just going to be super slow with how I approach this. No unnecessary crap, okay. Oh. <laughs> that fucking hitbox, man. Oh god, it bounced in my ass! Well, at least I have this now. And let, let, let's be patient about it. Let's be patient. There's a time limit, yes. But, be slow, take our time. You know. Help, 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 help. <laughs> uh. 
Last one. Last one. Here we go. Last one. Joe, what are you doing? I'm winning. I'm winning. This is the run. <laughs> no. The TVD logo boss. I like that. Oh shit, okay, well. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, fuck, I tried to get through there. Shit. Okay, I think I won at this point. Yes. Okay. Finally, man. Alright. Next part is not that bad, but again, I'm, I'm dealing with not too good lives here, so... Uh, you know, is that I have to worry about. And also this... Okay. Are there any extra lives? Uh, I think there's an extra life coming up here, maybe. And I really need it. Uh, the best, best, best defense here is the offense. It's just like, go ahead, start immediately, start throwing. Okay, double jump. There's a really b cool boss coming up, by the way. Really badass. Uh, Alright, what is this? Hey, it is an extra life! <sighs> Careful now. Okay. Don't really need that. I can brag with my points, man. Oh, okay. Okay, I, I, that is not even that bad. I thought we looked at a far worse situation, but... What are these frogs? There goes my meat. Okay, yeah. I feel that there must be a hidden place here somewhere. There's no way this game is just... Okay. Holy shit balls. Hello. Uh, Alright. Uh, here comes the boss. Oh my god. Reach. Gotta jump too, right? It's one hand down. <laughs> oh no, he's hot. <laughs> Gonna start throwing like multiple punches at me. Yes, here we go. Yeah, come on. Here we go. Awesome. Oh, man. My arms. 
Okay, extra life here, please. Uh, please. I'm ready for another run if, if, if I fuck this up, by the way. Oh, sweet. Got what I needed. Got what I needed. Oh, God. There's, there's another level coming up. This is the Cursed Forest. Uh, this is the last, second to last level in the game, and this is, this is sucks. <laughs> this is the choke kid. Let me quickly get this. I might, I might be able to get an extra life here, maybe. We will see. <sighs> Close. Oh, get away from me. Come back here. You come back here now. Hey! Oh, thanks. Ooh, we don't want to get bolas now. Um, please. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Joel, who is my favorite member of the Beatles? Uh, James Hetfield. Now, uh... I like, uh, I like Ringo. Because <laughs> Ringo is one of those people that, like, not an amazing drummer, but very meat and potatoes, and just, just happy. <laughs> okay, yeah. If, if I fuck up, and I die early before I get to the boss in this level. We're gonna listen to uh, Yoko Ono and um, Lennon's masterpiece called Cambridge 1969. And we're gonna enjoy it. We're gonna listen and learn. Holy shit, that was a good dodge. Okay. I'm just gonna say goodbye. Uh, nope, I'm good. Nah. Have I ever listened to Temporary Secretary by uh, Paul McCartney? Yes, I have. Uh, you don't actually perform that song live. Dude, Paul McCartney was a fucking genius. He he did like AI generated sounding music in like 1905. <laughs> like who who else was like making that shit? You know, genius man. <laughs> Die off screen. Okay, bye. Wait, is this the place I gotta? No, this this another place. Oh, is that the last life? Oh, last life, last life, uh, last life. Uh, last life. Uh, fuck this up, and we are not doing so good. Uh, okay, uh, okay. Uh, Good dodge, though. Oh, is, it, is it a good dodge? Okay. Uh, have you been blessed your eyes with Ringo's MS Paint Art? I think I've seen this. Yeah. Here's the key. I think it's top here. Uh, yes. This is the last tier in the game, by the way. It's coming up. Here it is. Okay, that's cryptic, but guess what? You also gotta do that. Isn't that just awesome? Worst weapon. Let's go. I think it's down. 
All right. Okay, this might actually kind of help. Okay. Here comes the boss. Who is it? Mendoza? Oh no. Uh. So I'm gonna be only looking at the ceiling when I'm doing this. You know, Daggers isn't that bad for this. Oh, hell. Oh, fuck. Oh, I did it. I did it. They will pay for this, I swear. part is quite bad. <laughs> it's quite bad, and uh, I really have the wrong kind of weapon for it too. But um, yeah, uh, this is this is before the final boss, so I might be able to beat this with my current continues. We'll see. Uh, no, I'm gonna keep that. There's a reason why well, I, I, I'm doing pretty okay at this part, because I died about a infinite amount of times until I said, fuck this, I'm just gonna like do the same level over and over and over again. Okay. No! Oh, oh! <laughs> no! Damn it! Really good, really good. That's some shit, man. Okay, another one coming up. Blah. Damn, man. That is, that is, that is crap. <laughs> uh, well, you know what they say. You know what they say. Oopsies. My name is... Helm. Alright, anyway. So here's Curse to see you again. And, uh... Well, we had, we had some good runs last time we did this, but uh, unfortunately I, I, uh... I did a great run that was ended um, on the final level and it, 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 it destroyed me from within. It's like that Jojo thing where um, Joseph is battling Darby and it's like you've already de de admitted defeat in your heart and I'm like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> but uh, <clears throat> anyway, so Curse, Curse Castillo, let me let me adjust the, the window so I can read what you guys are saying instantly without looking into my second monitor. So, um, show the last run again. Uh, well, it, it's just it's, it was just the last level, really. Yeah. Sound okay, by the way, guys? Uh, all that good shit. Too. Yep. Okay. So, if you're you're tuning in and you're wondering what what is this game all about, so this is a Ghost and Goblins tribute game. Except, I would argue it's, it has the same aesthetics of difficulty. <clears throat> and if I if I use three continues in this game, I'm getting a shit ending. And what I have to do is, like, not die. And if I want to get the super perfect ending, I have to use no continues at all. On top of getting these super hard to find items. And it's... it's nuts. Can I do it? Uh... Sure. <laughs> It would be pretty bad if I uh, 
if I'm able to clear this on on my non Harker Friday. But uh, we'll see. We'll see what I. Oh fuck it. Okay. Not that it really matters, but you know. This is on Steam. Yeah. This is on Steam. It's also on the Switch. It's on PlayStation 4. It's on Xbox. So you have a you have a ton of other options if you want to play it. But the Switch version is a little exclusive because you know Switch doesn't really have Chivos. So they instead just like built in the Chivos inside the game. So all right. Anyway, so if you want to know, um, if you're just tuning in, who here did not see the Hawker Friday of this? You know, who who is watching for the first time? Me. Okay. There's there's several people. Uh, oh fuck, I forgot the extra life again! Whatever, uh, I'm just gonna reset. <laughs> I'm gonna be resetting a lot here early in the game. Um, but anyway, this game, uh, I need the specific items even to get a good ending. Uh, or a mediocre ending, you know, there's several endings to this game. Yeah, it's not like that stream was literally yesterday, yeah, but, you know. First reset, baby. Some, uh, during the end of that stream, I was doing a complete autopilot. Like, I was streaming the game, and I'm like, yeah, things are happening on screen, but it's not registering my brain. <laughs> oh, chicken. Alright. Am I gonna forgive the mermaids this time? I'll try, I'll try, but... We'll see. <laughs> anyway, uh... Something I wanted to talk about tonight on stream, like, it was... It was something. It was something, but then, then I, then I forgot to. <laughs> Beatrice. No, it wasn't just Beatrice. Ploppily says, Leon doesn't believe that I told you about my movie. What, what do you mean, sir? What's going on here? Alright, I'm gonna try to get as much loot here as possible because I want extra lives, so, you know. <clears throat> Remember the bolas. I'm not getting the bolas! The bolas are t terrible, man. I don't like them. The, no bolas. Well, I don't. <laughs> bolas aren't good, guys. I mean, I, I'll do it, I guess, if you really want it, but. But you know that's gonna make this harder? <laughs> that's it's hard enough, goddammit. No, I'm I I'll I will get it. If I get it out of an accident, I'll keep it, you know. <laughs> there we go. Alright, now let's not fuck that up again, please. Bolas means balls in Spanish, and we think it's funny. I, you mean that? No. You mean all this time I've been cracking like ball jokes, and I've been making tasteless jokes? Oh man. Damn. Damned. <laughs> Nothing here. Huh? So uh, on the last level, there was a lot of people saying like, "Oh, Joel, secret, secret, secret." And, um, I think people were literally, like, uh, uh, joking, a little funny funny. I don't think, I thought, I don't think people were, were, literally knew what they were talking about. Hmm, I don't know. Tell me. Joel, this game is called, uh, Maltida Castilla, not Curse Castilla. Well... This is the Steam release, and the original game is freeware. Okay. Uh, Alright, we gotta be careful here. We don't wanna... Well, you know, th this room for mistakes early on. Like, it's not like a huge deal, but... You know. There we go. 
I'm also a little extra concentrated when I'm streaming shit like this because, like, as soon as I start talking about, like, fecal funny, you know, it, it all goes to crap. Uh, Okay. <laughs> Arm looks like Squidward, he does. Okay, yeah. That and when you say this run is good. Yeah, we have to not say this run is good. Sipopoli says, well, I have a new movie and the bore moods, bore mods are deleting my comments. So I asked you, uh, ugh. Uh, so I asked you what to do. Uh, you told me to contact the mods. He doesn't believe that you said that. Uh, well... I can't... Um... <laughs> tell what, tell what. Can I get back to you after the stream, perhaps? Because right now I'm, like, knee-deep in, in, like, a thousand birds trying to, like, pick off my eyes. <laughs> n n next stream, I'll, I'll, I'll see what I can do, but... but... All right, thanks, man. All right, well, anyway, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, I was gonna say... This is, like, like, a, like a weird topic to talk about, but does anybody else heal wounds really slowly? Like, I swear to God, like, like four weeks ago, I dropped a, uh, some, some, uh, like, a, uh... Di dish soap is that what it's called now? Uh, dish soap bottle on my foot while doing the dishes, and I bled a little bit, but it's still like a huge wound. <laughs> oh, that's diabetes. Oh yeah. <laughs> well, join the club, guys. Okay. Quesada. Why the fuck was that soap bottle made out of it that it made you bleed? It was just like a heavy plastic and it dropped on my foot and the, the top of the bottle, you know, where the, uh, the, uh, the actual soap comes out, was like uncorked and it was like a big stabby pointy plastic bit that went thump into my foot. So, you know, and that, that was, uh, you know. I swear to God, every fucking morning that I wake up, I always, like, slam into walls. Like, that first initial morning pee at, like, you know, 7 in the morning, I swear to God, I, I crash into, like, walls and, and and stuff like an idiot. And I'm like, uh... Same. <laughs> it's awful. Okay, I'm doing pretty bad right now, quote unquote. All right, that's where the run has decided if it's if it's worth it or not. All right. Wait, I replaced my wedding ring because I smashed it into the doorways every other time. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> <laughs> How? What are what do you replace it with? One of those like uh, kid kid uh, ca candy rings, right? Ring pops. <laughs> replace it with divorce. Okay, it's getting a little dark now. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Something here last time. It was like. It was not here, it was like on the other part. Oh god. And the people people here in Sweden, like they don't even get married. They just like in a relationship anyway and they'll still have kids for like their entire lives. And people like people just don't like get married. Oh fuck it. I mean not like you need to. It's kind of weird in, in that way. I don't know why I'm talking about this subject in particular, but isn't it weird how, like, you, you, you can be, in, like, couples are, like, in madly in love with each other, right? And they might be, like, 
in a bad mood. And as soon as the dude says, I want to marry you, they're like, oh, my God. You know, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. You're going to marry me? You know, it's like, yeah, but why, why does that make anything better? <laughs> I mean, it's nice, I guess, but it's, I don't know. I don't know. I guess it's the, the classic idea of we have to get married. You know. <laughs> I'm talking about marriage on stream. Okay, by, by the way, just because I was so occupied talking about some random stupid shit, I'm now doing very badly, quote unquote. Do y'all marry me so we can have really ugly children? <laughs> okay. <laughs> really ugly children. I gotta, I gotta say, like, you know when pe people say that babies are cute? I don't think babies are cute. They're kind of gross. I mean, that, that's a horrible thing to say. But like, oh, my baby's so cute. And I'm like... Yeah. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Girls, baby. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay, okay. The babies look like aliens. I was talking about this last stream, actually, but... You know, we were talking about antlions. Antlions in real life. We were talking about um, early in the stage. There's, there's these birds that like crack out of an egg, and the first thing they do is just instinctually go after you and try to kill you. It was like, is there any animal in real life that has the first instinct in the world as they're born is just murder? And antlions do that apparently. And I just love the idea, of, like instinct has taught them that the first thing they should do in existence is just fuck shit up, born to kill. <laughs> what the hell, you know? <laughs> Can anybody explain to me? I, I don't know if there's any uh, cat expert here, but why, why is why is kittens like eyes blue when they're like little babies, but then they like don't have that eye color anymore? What's up with that? Lack of pigment. Oh, that's what it is. Okay. Born to die. Okay. Joe, the first thing the first thing a baby giraffe has happened to it as it as it gets kicked in the head after falling ten feet until it has learned well, let me read that again. The first thing a baby giraffe has happened to it is to get kicked in the head after falling ten feet until it learns to stand. <laughs> this is awful. That's how I was born. Ah, uh, just one of those days, you know? Okay, well, I'm okay. I'm in the key here anyway, so... Kudos to anyone who, like, works with children, by the way, because... The people that work, like, at a preschool and stuff like that, like, at some point, you have to be, like... It's like that Arnold Arnold scene. Shut up! Like, how do you not lose your shit? Because you're like, oh, I'm tired in the morning, and the first thing is kids going. <laughs> 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 oh, okay. <sighs> <laughs> 
Someone in the chat goes, it's not that bad. You can fart all you want and blame the kids. <laughs> you, you need some values in life, man. Okay. How many here has siblings? You know what, fuck it, let's go here too, so I can get extra lives on top of this too. Okay, let's put, let's, there's, there's a lot of people that have siblings and stuff. Uh, I have a question. Have you, have you ever... Have you ever blamed your siblings for something you did? And... Because you, you are such a good liar... Your mom... <laughs> your mom will, like, actually believe you. And just, like... <laughs> give the blame to your sibling. Wow, okay. That's pretty... Pretty ruthless, guys. <laughs> By the way, seven lives, not bad. But I'm probably gonna fuck up at the Manticore here, though, so... Is there really nothing on that side? Whatever. Just to release some, something. Don't you dare jinx it, I'll try. Yeah, this is a crap run. <laughs> okay, yeah. I really do love this game. Joel, am I playing on easy mode? Yeah. <laughs> the run fucking sucks, Lamau. Okay, yeah. We actually enc encountered a glitch um, in a other run. Actually, I'm doing doing terrible right now. Okay. Um. Terrible, man. Can't believe it. Awful, awful run. I kind of want to go for the, uh... Fuck it. Some good that helped me. Alright, whatever. Whoo! Reset. You do have to be careful for real though. Like I don't, I literally don't want to like start fucking up for no damn reason. Okay. Has a cat ever slashed me? Yeah, it just did. And what, uh, the word slashing implies like a like a blade weapon, which makes it sound like this cat stabbed me. Mr. Meow Nay! I was just kidding. I was just kitten. <laughs> ah! Okay. This is fine though, like, having, having one, having one less life, it's like, whatever. And besides, I, I would describe myself as pretty, 
okayish at Don Quixote. Quixote. Don Quixote. <laughs> Don Quixote. Alright. Oh, good spot too. Good spot too, man. Alright. Ooh, this, this could be a bad, bad thing though. No, no, no. We're, we're still gravy. We're still gravy. Shit. Oh, come on, I'm a stupid. Well, whatever. Uh, oh, another one too, that's good. That's that's good. Uh, hey, look at that. Joel, how am I this bad? I don't know. I I didn't go to gamer school. <laughs> Feel that? Do you feel that? Do you feel what I'm feeling? I'm a, I'm not gonna go for the the flame sword. I'm gonna still invoke the Lady of the Lake, but I will not be carrying the sword. Nor 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 will I spare the mermaids, because I'm not going for a perfect thing. I'm going for like an okayish ending, and that that'll be it. And perhaps on the next Harker Friday, we can, like, you know, go for that perfect ending, but right now, uh-uh. Don't unlike that. Uh, actually, she's right there, but, you know, I, I, I can't be arsed. So... I just hope I can do the uh, the the, uh, the turtles because they are so bad. Uh, okay, this reminds me a lot of Act Race. So th this area, this swamp. Uh. All right, here we go. Here we go. Oh boy, oh boy! I'm gonna be very quiet for this because I will need it. Should I go for the uh, the secret pe uh, secret uh, secret people thing on the next level? I mean, it it's just like extra points, really. But uh, yeah, all right, okay. Alright. 
point though is that I'm very quiet during this because I, I just Yes Okay I need I need more uh I need more time <laughs> Well, I'll, I'll still do it. I'll still get the, the, the tear. That's what's m the most important thing here. Am I supposed? How am I supposed to do this with, with the time? Uh, it's it's not extremely difficult, but y I'm gonna have to be forced to find more uh, more of those things. I basically have to speed run this shit. I don't think I found him. Okay. Damn, we're doing pretty good. Yeah, I mean bad, bad. I'm doing very bad right now. There we go. What's this? Oh, okay. 23 seconds. Let's go. <laughs> Fucking leg it. Not need that. No time though. <laughs> Can I kill him in 14 seconds? Let's find out. No way, right? Holy shit, I did it. Still, I ran out of time for the uh, the actual boss, so. You know, but whatever, man. That's that's a bad bad thing. I, I don't like that. That's just like the, the time doesn't carry over, you know. So, but I'm I'm gonna die here anyway because again the time ran out. So now I'm stuck with the uh, the basic weapon, which is which is fine, I guess. I don't I don't I actually prefer the sword over the bolas, which is like the same weapon technically, but the bolas is better. But I don't know. I, I just feel it's weirdly more precise. I don't know. Um, all right, what do we got? Okay. Again, I don't want to. I'm gonna take my time with this because we don't we don't want to start accidentally rushing this. And he's like dying right now. Okay. And <laughs> if this game had fall damage, yeah, right.
All right, well, I can get an extra life here if I'm good with my shots, so... And I'm getting an extra life soon, right? One more, one more, one more. I need one more. Yes! Sweet. Yes! Extra life as well. Badass. Okay. Have you and Vinny done a video together? A video? Like stream? <laughs> Yeah, we've done, done, done tons of streams together, man. Last we did, we played uh, Connect 4 for charity. I think it's on Vinny's channel. Alright. Bit Connect. Did you like that the Connect 51? Not Connect 54. <laughs> well, that's funny. The, the Clubhouse 51 games. It was just connect four every fucking time. <laughs> connect fifty four. Okay. Careful now. Is there any bit connect video games? <laughs> Maybe. Minecraft. Sorry that I'm so so quiet when I'm doing this, but usually I have to shut the fuck up in order to not like die every time. All right. I don't want stupid accidents like that one. Dude, I can't wait for Spelunky too. Like I, I, the frustration that is in this game right now. It's going to be tenfold as I'm doing Spelunky 2, coming out next next month. <sighs> Better this time. Is there anything up here? Ah, whatever. Yeah. I can't wait for Stunky. Uh, I can take one hit. I wish the death roulette was up though, but you know, I love doing Spelunky death roulette, but the website just like hasn't been updated in a million years, so you know. But man, death roulette was fun. And I, there was always the people who betted that I would win, and I was just like, here's another shit run. <laughs> always believed in me, always believed in me, and I always appreciated that. I lost all the, all the money, all the money. Out in, just in case we have some funnyaccident.com. <laughs> I hope that some of these websites aren't real. Oh, come on! The fuck is this? Hitbox. Hitboxes. Alright. 
It's all about being careful here. You don't want dumb deaths. Okay. That one hurt. Uh oh. I wasn't sure how much time I had anyway on that that run. No, 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 no. Fucking hell, man. Forty-two sec. I, I don't. I'm not sure if that would have been would have been uh, adequate. For for the the boss, because the boss takes a while to kill anyway. You know the 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 the, the sword here might actually be the better weapon for dealing with with this this level in particular because it has the best reach. Probably get an extra life just in case. Uh, where though? I can't ask for that. Oh no. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? I think I'm putting too much pressure on myself by not talking. <laughs> like, th there, there's so much... There's so much, uh, At stake that I, like, by not breathing, I think I'm fucking it up. <laughs> like... I need, I need to relax a little bit, because there's so much at stake that I'm like... <sighs> okay, sick, sickle, sick, sickle might actually work here. We'll see, though. I'm not a big fan. Okay, that that that's fine. That's fine. Can turn around. Okay. Open your mouth. Yeah, I've already won. It's it's fine. It's fine at this point. Or is it? Yeah, it's fine. Okay. That scouting usually like fucks me up, but not this time. I'm <laughs> adding failing now. Ugh. Okay. Is there any other extra items in this area? I wonder. I mean, I, I know where all the the traps are here, but. Oh, there's, there's a little bit up there, but... Alright, whatever. Alright. No continues yet. No continues yet. Joel, have you ever done a big weed before, like a real gamer? Um, well, you see, when you're a video game athlete like I do, I don't wanna, I don't wanna do uh, performance-enhancing drugs, because at the Video Game Olympics, aka Jeff Keighley's uh, Video Game Awards, um, when the awards are given out, I don't want Jeff Keighley to be like. And by the way, Joel, we we know now that you uh, did lots of gamer weed, 
so you will not be getting the video game trophy from Hideo uh, Bojima. No, yeah, I was just kidding. I thought it was oregano. What the fuck? The pizza baker said it was oregano on my pizza. I didn't know it was weird. Shit. Tragic. Oh, hey, there's something up there. Ah, good, good. Okay, well, I already have all the shit that I want. There's some loot multiplier, though. You know, let's, let's get that instead. There we go. Get out of here, huh? See how, see how great this weapon is with uh, Sickle? Look at the weapon, I mean, see how great... Well, I better shut the fuck up, I'm doing this. Actually, let's, let's leave the slime alone. Man. The slime has done nothing. Okay, this this part is, is this one that I keep dying on, so... Uh, it's, you know, clen clench the, the bu battle a little bit. My finger is battle. I didn't know to respawn, so I, I can't take my time here. Okay. Careful now. Again, we don't want to have accidentes on stream. That was the hard part. Smooth sailing from now on, I guess. Alright, it's very important I get the key too. And it's very important that I get the... Uh, the Holy Fire. Now, I'm not very good with the Holy Fire against the boss, but it, I have to fucking get the Holy Fire for... Uh, for the next part, because... Um, if I fuck up at this part, the... Uh, it's, uh, yeah. Sorry, mermaids. Oh! Well, well. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh, I can't hear nothing. Hello. Uh oh. Uh, game? Okay, okay, there we go. King just went quiet on me. Okay. <sighs> oh, that was so bad. That was so bad, man. Oh, that was so unnecessary. Well, I can just hope that I get an extra life or something. Frog, no, please. Can I bait him by going here? No, god damn it. Okay. Okay. What if we have double jump he can get up there? Probably. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> uh -oh. Okay, well I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to do this. I'm sorry, mermaids. I wish it didn't have to be this way, but Okay, I'm doing this extremely hard mode. This is the end of the run if I fuck this up. If I die now, I, I, literally, the, the whole run is destroyed. I, ca I, I cannot die. I, I, otherwise, I have to reset everything. Where 
not clear yet. I did it still. I did it still. I did it still, though. But now I have, like, the sword for this, which, again, it's not the worst. I, I would have preferred Sickle. But, whatever. Again, I, I have to excuse myself for being so quiet during these turns, but uh, there is a lot at stake. And it, it, as soon as I stop concentrating, it's gonna be like, well, fecal funny, then dead. Okay. That was stupid. <laughs> that was really stupid. I don't know why the fuck I did that. Just because you think you're about to win doesn't mean you're, you are, so... Whatever you do, just take your fucking time. Okay. This part, uh... It's not that bad, for some reason. Like, it's like the game is almost rewarding you for being like, Oh yeah, you, you made it this far, buddy? Alright. I do need... What, what is in here? Okay, yeah. That could have easily fucked me up really bad. <laughs> what? Oh, damn it. How do you die by a fucking frog? Okay, that, that's fine. I have an extra life here in, in this level anyway. Froggers. <laughs> Speak English. Looked like I needed the extra time, but you know, <laughs> bad English. All right. Do we have any extra things here? No. Okay. What if I didn't make that jump and I just like fell down into a pit? Thump. Hello. It's a bad spot actually. I thought it was the other one that I need to get down to with which which has a weapon. Here's this dude. This dude. I'm gonna clear this out before we have uh, another funny accident talk on. Alright, thanks. Yeah, I'll get that. What's up here? Oh, yes, okay. And we keep this momentum going, we don't fuck this up. Some stupid crap. Okay. Might get an extra life soon. Frog, frog. Okay, yeah, there we go. for the, the loud keyboard tapping, but, uh, you know. Oh, 
shit. One life I can I can spare. Is he gonna do the yep, yeah, okay. Oh holy shit, I thought I was getting hit there for a second. I don't know how I avoided that. Did he deserve that? No. He should read. The, he should read his codex or his uh, his lore description. <laughs> it's literally he gobbles down a whole cattle. <laughs> he, he's a little naughty, you know. Shit. Damn it! I could have gone an extra life. I was a little quicker with that. Fuck. <laughs> Ah, whatever. Last level. Last level. Do I want the score multiplier? Uh, I'm gonna play it safe, actually. Is anything up there? No. So it's it's bottom up down right for the uh, the, the passage here. So to make sure. This is inspired by Ghosts and Goblins, uh, clearly, but it's more like a tribute to those games in general instead of just like a specific game. But I also feel like this tribute goes beyond just being a tribute. And it, it's it's his own great game. like I prefer this game to Ghost and Goblins, I I, I honestly do, because the, the the soundtrack is more like an arcade FM synth thing going on. Like the, the gameplay feels smoother, and like the, the frame rate or I don't know what you want to call it, but uh, yeah, I I actually do prefer this. Is it? Oh god! Remember when I fucked this up last time? The trick here is to be bossy, but also like be careful, which is <laughs> an oxymoron, but or not an oxymoron, it's a contradiction. Whatever that I can, I can take that, I can take that. Careful, Billy. There we go. So it's... It's up and then down, right? Oh, fuck, which one is it? Because uh, I want to redo that. It's up, right? It's up, okay. Anything here? All right, whatever. let's go. Last item. <gasps> Shit. Okay. If I can get the, uh, if I can get, uh, holy fire. Oh yes, I can. Get here. Oh, okay. <laughs> I would love if I can. Maybe there's something up there. I feel there could be, but. I mean, there's tree stumps, so. Nope, there's nothing. Okay, whatever. So, how I remember this part? Oh, no. It's fine. <laughs> 
it's fine. It, 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 it might, might seem bad, but we already have all the items that are required anyway, and we haven't lost anything, so... Uh, It just, the holy fire makes this next boss a, a piece of cake. But I used to do it the hard way. Like we've been doing. Oh, wait a minute. I gotta redo this! <laughs> oh, I gotta redo all this shit. Okay. Yeah, piece of cake. For fuck's sake, man. So goddamn unnecessary. Okay. Yeah, at least you can get some more points, you know, that's that extra life maybe. You gotta you gotta see it that way, I guess. Woo! Close. You can get the holy fire again? I don't know if I can, but I will certainly try. Now I have a lot of health, though. <laughs> Shit. Oh, there's something up here. Well, goddamn, look at that. Okay, we need to be very careful here. I guess I can get the... Let's, let's be careful that we actually get it, too. <sighs> okay. 45... 54 seconds. Don't want to die now. Do not want to die now. had one one more life there god damn no no okay this just has to be a perfect run man can't fuck it up can't fuck it up can't die can't do nothing here God damn, that sucked! Fucking awful! Oh, man. Okay. I'm gonna get this. Okay, it, it might help, it might help, it might not help, we'll see. Motherfucker. here again. God damn, we have to be so careful here, man. I hate, I, yeah, the flowers are awful to deal with. Come on. Go. 
Honestly, is it even worth it to get the fucking... I, I, you know, like... I would honestly say, let's keep the fucking sword or something like that, because with the Holy Fire, I can't reach. I, I just can't. Is it upper bottom? I'm too stressed out to think, honestly. It, it's bottom, right? Bottom up, down, right? Bottom, okay. I'm gonna clear out every single obstacle here because I will not deal with another one of those deaths. Should have done that a while ago. I don't know why I flinched up there. I don't know why I flinched up there. First continue. Shit. that death. <sighs> okay, it all comes tumbling down now. <sighs> this fucking part sucks. It is so bad. This is when that lo run died last time. These fucking spikes, man. Last stream we did of this, people said, like, get the secret, Joel, get the secret. And, the, like, in the game's code, there is no secret on this level, so... <laughs> okay. that okay gonna go with sickle gonna go with sickle for the last boss here or last boss quote unquote I've had some experience with this boss before, so it should not be, be a problem.
can't reach. I can't reach with these fucking weapons, man. I have to be real ballsy with this. Oh! All right, sword time. Sword actually might be better for this. Alright, now, this, this is where the game would have ended if I didn't get those five extra items. Uh, now the game is gonna go hard. Like, th th this is where the game gets difficult. Like, everything up until this point was just a joke. Uh, now the fucking real game begins. This is hell, and it's it's quite difficult. <laughs> it's quite difficult. They're already fucking up. Great. Jesus Christ Almighty. How many continues do I have left? I, I, I'm too stressed out to actually- Fuck! One. Just one.
I need full health. Uh, I, I'm gonna have to take a hit. Like, I, I can't deliver enough firepower to kill him, you know? Hardest part of the game coming up. This is most likely when the run dies, because this part is like borderline impossible for me to do. It's it's insane. The, the only way I can do this part is with, with dumb sheer luck. Like, it, it's absolute insanity coming up. Remember how I said, like, you know those birds? How they're gonna amplify that? Yeah, this is the part. As if it wasn't like bad enough with fucking shit. I oh! Jesus fucking Christ! Good lord! It does not fuck around this level. Is this my last continue or do I have one, one left? One left, okay. There's still there's still hope then. There's still hope then, but like th this part is is insane. And it gets worse, it gets worse too. Like they don't stop. Like this part right here with the, the demons, they, they it's even more than this. Like it, it's absolute mayhem. Like, look at this shit! God damn man, what the fuck? Last one. <sighs> oh, it's so difficult, man. <laughs> oh, man, I'm so stressed. Like, you need sickles, I would say. Like, if you don't have sickles, uh, you're sickle out of luck. Sorry. <laughs> Don't know what the best person like seriously get getting the extra the extra life that's up there that's an extra life by the way it's like i can't i don't know if it's worth it man Do you think it's enough on screen, game? Guys, should I go for the extra life? It, that means I have to go back and deal with even more demons. Well, no, 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 no. I'm inclined to agree. That was an insane dodge I just performed. I don't know. That was a frame off from death. I know what I want. I don't want to do the wrong one, though. Come on. Is there 
anything down here that could benefit me. Okay, whatever. Right out. Last area of the game. <laughs> And this is a long part, too. It's not like it's gonna give up suddenly. It, they're doing a boss rush, by the way. So, uh, you know. Don't you love those parts where it's just like, yeah, by the way. So you better remember all the shit you did with the other bosses, because you're gonna need it. I don't need this crap. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick this. I'm gonna pick that. Check this out, by the way. So you drop another, not a, not one of these dudes, right? So if you want to get a perfect run in this game, like you want to get everything, check this out. Check, check, check this out. They expect you to know this. Like you would, you would figure that out, huh? <laughs>
final, final boss. Sorry, I can't I can't talk right now. I have three three chances of this. Three chances. <clears throat> chances at this. I'm gonna take a... Um, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna... I'm gonna get the shield. I'm gonna get the shield just for the extra... extra life, essentially. Fucking believe I did that. <sighs> I actually did it. I actually did it. <laughs> I did, I don't think my my heart beat once there, man. My God. I mean, thank God for that shield. Thank God for that shield. And I even I even got a great ending too. 
fucking unbelievable. Man. That shield saved saved my ass, saved my bacon. My God, man! Oh, dear God! <laughs> oh, and you get a happy, good ending at the end too. Like otherwise, it would have just been like, eh. oh man, what a fucking mess! That seriously, one of the hardest games I ever beat. Like seriously, my my heart was pounding like do dum do dum do dum. As I was doing that, but uh, <sighs> first time beating it. Yep, first time beating it. <sighs> well, the the very good ending without dying. You know, I've always used continues, but this is the first time I was able to um, play the game. Uh, without using all the uh, basically you do you do a deal with death if you continue for three times uh, You get an ending where you die at the end um, Like as I escape the castle you you die and you join those souls that are drifting at the top and the game is rolls the credits So you don't see this part And you show the difference endings, please. I, I, I will. I will. Holy hell! My king, the demon that haunted our lands is gone forever, and with the and with him, the curse of Castilla. Your bravery is unrivaled, Don Ramiro. The bards will find no words for your prowess. Could I grant you a gift in gratitude? Just a decent grave for my fallen friends, sir. And charity for their families, sir. <laughs> your heart is kind, Ramiro. And so it will be the feast for your victory! And here's, here's the good ending. I, er, I earned this feast. Oh, what a hard motherfucking game, but I did it. Enjoy this moment of glory! You can be proud of your great play, but are you good enough to become a legend? This is where those extra, extra things come into play. And I did not invoke the Lady Leg, be kind with the Sirens, and use no continue, no continues whatsoever is required for this ending. So, no fucking continues at all! And if you manage to get all these, there's a picture of you uh, in a statue. Got some merits though. Um. <laughs> Just one life. Uh, good lord, man. Yeah, it's it's quite the uh, endeavor to do it, but get, you know, there you go. That's the end. There's Curse Castilla and. Uh, that's the good ending. That is the good ending. You have a feast and uh, you know and the other endings in this game uh, is basically bad ending number one is that if you don't find all the Morris tears uh, before you go into Los Farrells, whatever his name is, um, gate, you um, you essentially let me let me put my name down here. You go back to the castle and you report to King saying, I can't get in. And he's like, oh, your your quest has been in vain. And you're like, what? And it turns out the king has been already possessed by the devil. And then it just kind of fades to black. And the end. Medium ending is um, you save, um, you defeat the... Um, 
you defeat Luz Farrell and and you break the curse of Castilla, but you die, and you join the uh, the the uh, the souls drifting away. Um, and the good ending that I got was no use less than three four or three continues, and again you join the king and you have a feast. And then the super ending is just uh, uh, this. Exactly what we saw, except at the very end, they show a picture of you as a statue. And that's the difference, really. And the bragging rights, but, yeah. But, uh, that, that's... I'm, I'm not gonna show... I'm not gonna show the endings on YouTube. You can look that up yourself. I feel like if I show the endings now, it would... Demystify it a little bit. Where I feel like I should just show it myself, if that's the case. You know? But I I can't fucking breathe again. That was nuts. That was nuts. That was fucking crazy. That was fucking crazy. <sighs> oh man. The super ending doesn't seem very much more worth, worth it. Well, it is for the the chivo, I guess. You know. But uh, what a bunch of shit. <laughs> well, I'm happy. I'm very happy that I was able to do it, but. Um, it, it's one of those games where your your heart like it's so much at stake as you're doing it, and I'm I'm glad I could do it in front of you guys. <laughs> but uh, that was that was nuts, and thank you for for uh, cheering me on at the end and giving me your energy and all that good stuff. But uh, that was I was fucked. Blah, blah. I feel like it's one of those games where, like, now that I beat it, I don't want to go back and play it again. Because <laughs> I feel like, can my heart take that again? <laughs> well... Uh, mamma mia. Well, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. Let's keep going with this good stream streak. With this good vibe energy we have. And then let's play some uh, blind uh, Mario Paint. So I'll be right back. Sit tight and more shit coming up. But uh, I want to thank you again for joining for Curse Castilla. Very hard game. And I highly recommend that you check out this game yourself and find out just how hard it is. Because uh, it does not fuck around at all. So, there you go. Anyway, uh, there you go. Uh, be right back, sit tight, and uh, more stuff coming up. Don't go nowhere. <laughs>